Hello, my lovelies. How is everyone doing? I'm going to check that my mic is working. Yep, seems to be. <laughs> How are you guys doing? Hey, Brad. I see you redeemed first. Somehow, somewhere you're first. You weren't expecting a stream. It's later than usual. Okay, my brain needs to think for a second. My daylight savings just ended and the clock went forward. So... It should actually be an hour earlier than you're expecting. I'm going live an hour earlier. 7 p.m. my time. But it's an hour earlier, I think. I, I, daylight savings with my head in sometimes. I've been feeling the effects and it's only an hour. It's only an hour of jet lag, but it's like, what is happening? <laughs> it's 2 a.m. for you. What time was it normally when I would start stream? Wasn't that the time I started? Hey, Sifo, how are you doing? Morning, for me anyway. You saw me go live and you thought I'd dro you'd drop by? Well, welcome in. It's really, really lovely to see you here. It's really lovely to see you here, actually. Um, welcome. Welcome to my quarter of the universe. A little different to Watson's, I will say. <laughs> No, it's 12 a.m. normally when you go live. I haven't had two hours of difference. The clock back, the clock went, hold on. <laughs> My brain's exploding. The clock only went back by one hour. So I don't know whether 12 to 2 a.m. happened. Literally the clock only went back by an hour. So it went back by an hour. Oh my God, my brain. What is daylight savings? I don't even know anymore. It's 10 a.m. for you and you're not working. <laughs> so you catch people usually don't. Aw, that's really nice to like try out different communities and, and the different um, vibes even or, or to see like a game you love being played a different way. Well, I'm really glad that you chose me, Seppo. Welcome in. Fuck, that means my daylight savings are yours are stacking. Oh, has you like have you just had daylight savings start or something? Man, I'm... Otherwise, my brain just exploded. <laughs> otherwise, I think you just broke <laughs> my brain. But no, it still shouldn't. It should technically realign. Because... Wait, it should only realign. I just lost an hour a couple of weeks ago. But I gained an hour. Okay, so hold on, you lost and I gained. I guess that's where the gap's coming from. God damn. God damn, it's too hard. <laughs> the clocks here went forward on the 26th. Did they? So, wow. I just... It still breaks my brain, I'm not gonna lie. You've been going live at 1am the last couple of weeks. So, if I should... Oh, what? Uh, what? I haven't changed my stream time. How's it gone from 12 to 1 and now 12 to 2? I don't understand. They should just keep the times the same. <laughs> but you're potentially in the UK, right, Seppo? I've, uh, I've lived in London. I feel like it makes more sense for you guys to have something like Daylight Savings because you are so drastically, like, um, you are? Yeah, so, like, living in London even, I noticed, like... Maybe you need daylight savings in the opposite months, though. Like, it shouldn't be daylight savings in summer to have more light. I don't know. Is this making sense? Because I remember living in London and it would be like winter and 4 p.m. and kids would be walking home from school in the dark. Maybe you need winter to go back an hour so you have a bit more sunshine in the winter? Does... does I don't know. I don't know. Maybe we should just leave our time zones as they are. But it makes more sense for you guys to have a daylight savings to me anyway. Because, like, your sun actually changes depending on, on, on the seasons. For me here in Australia, it's pretty much the same. It's pretty much the same. An hour, extra hour of light makes no difference. <laughs> it's pretty much the same. It's, it's, it makes no difference. Our sun still rises at the same time and still sets at the same time, basically. It's not like you guys where it could be sunny from 4 a.m. to 11 p.m. Or in winter, it could be sunny from, I don't know, I should think it was like 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. or something. Crazy. 
it was 12 a.m. the 1 a.m. now 2 a.m. You're going live the same time. My clock just doesn't match yours. Well, I understand that. <laughs> I'm just wondering. I, I don't know. It's too hard. I'd be quite happy if they just kept it in GMT. Not really sure the British summertime is needed, but I get about I get about going home in the dark. I go to work in the dark and home in the dark in winter. Gosh, I remember that. I remember it because I'm also not very good at cold. I can't help it. I just, I'm not very good at cold. Love winter fashion. I don't mind the cold, but I hate feeling cold. Oh my gosh. I am such a wuss when it comes to like feeling cold. I can't handle it. I go to bed with hot water bottles. Um, and I mean, like I could have the heating system on, that's fine. But like the hot water bottle is that intense bit of heat, like, like curling around a fire. It's just this intense bit of heat that I can just wrap myself around. I am such a wimp when it comes to being cold. So I remember London and I remember getting up to go to work and I'd be at work before the sun's even up. Well, actually I would go to work and the sun would be up, but it's like still rising. It's still dark. Man, I remember. <laughs> It was depressing. It was so sad. Yeah, it stays out, light out longer at the moment. Oh, I think I just have something in my eye. Oh, um, during winter it gets dark quicker at like six. It doesn't get dark to almost eight now. Well, yeah, I mean, I, I understand why they also assign daylight savings to summer because summer it's warm. You want to be out in the light for longer and, and seasonally summer the days are longer and winter the days are shorter but I'm wondering if we're meant to not if we're meant to if we're going to keep a daylight saving system maybe it should swap anyway so that in winter you just get more daylight <laughs> and it's less depressing there's literally a thing called sad seasonal affective disorder and the northern countries especially feel that there's there's a higher rates of depression and anxiety in in the countries up north that have really short days through winter and maybe we just need to swap the daylight saving systems so that winter days are longer there's sunshine for longer maybe i don't know i don't really feel the cold i mean i've been known to go to work on a t-shirt that's minus two degrees Nope, nope. I am from a coastal Australian town. It is beachy. It's not always like summer here, but it's warm. <laughs> the coldest we get is maybe maybe eight to six degrees in the nighttime. And there are definitely parts of Australia that get cold. Like uh, not too far away from me is, is a more country town. It's more inland, which is why it gets colder. <laughs> that has been known to snow at Christmas time. And in Australia, Christmas is in the summertime. But, <laughs> but me personally, I am from a coastal, beachy, east coast Australia city and it's warm. So I'm very privileged, but cold of any kind, I am such a wimp. I'm such a wimp. <laughs> I could not do a t-shirt at minus two. No way, no how. I just want the weather to stay the same as it is right now. You're dreading June to September. June to September for you is hot, right? So you're dreading the heat heat. You just want the nice weather. <laughs> you don't want the intense heat. <laughs> I still find it fascinating that our seasons are reversed, right? So I have a friend in Canada right now and it's her birthday today. And I literally like messaged her this morning, a birthday message, but I was like, wait a second. I think this might be the first time I've realized that technically our birthdays are both in spring. But right now her birthday for me is autumn. And when it comes around to my birthday, my birthday is autumn for her. But technically we were both born in the spring. Like things like that are crazy. And let me tell you, a summertime Christmas is very different. It's still fantastic. Like Australians have, like if you celebrate Christmas, Australians have made a pretty good Christmas time despite it being summer. But when I lived in London, there was definitely something very magical. Like movie magic, literally. Like films that we watch. It's, it's, it is more magical, I think, having Christmas in winter. I mean, we've done a pretty good job of making summer Christmas pretty cool, but it's, it's just different. It's so different. 
it's cold right now for me. Client climate change has been a wild ride in California. I bet it has. Oh my goodness. The Californian fires you guys had at the beginning of COVID, crazy. I think the fires we had just before that, um, we call them the Black Friday fires. I think they might have been like the worst, but you guys had a really insane uh, uh, summer, I remember. And I remember that we were sending firefighters who had just gone through Black Friday over to you guys, even though it was COVID time, to try and help, like, help with that situation. And I, I, I just can't help but think, like, that is an intense, freaking job. And the poor firefighters of Australia who had just gone through Black Friday to then go to the Californian fires. They're freaking heroes, man. That would have been just beyond intense. Like, beyond. That's the thing. Whenever people think of Christmas, it's always snow. Well, exactly. Because we've grown up with media sharing it that way. And maybe it's the media that has made it seem magical. But it... Yeah, yeah, still, like, Christmas in winter is definitely more magical. Christmas in summer is fun. It's really fun. We have barbecues, we go swimming, we go out to the lakes and the beaches and picnics and, and like, New Year's Eve is freaking awesome in the summer. Love that. Like, you just have parties and it's warm and it's delightful, Mm, but... Yeah, I, I, I'm, I'm a Christmas person. I love the idea of trying to make Christmas magical. And I don't know if that's to do with my upbringing. <laughs> we won't dig into that anymore. But I mean, I don't know. I don't know. Christmas to me was about the magic of your family and your community and sharing that love around. And I love Christmas films. I just do. I just do. So that's probably why I thought winter was more magical for Christmas. But, you know, media. (laughs) And, you know, it gets in here and it (laughs) it changes us. No, see, it's been raining almost every day for two months now. It never rains here. Oh, you want it to stay raining? There was even a tornado that made touchdown near LA last week. It was a smaller one. Wow. But, like, shit, it's changing fascinating very interesting I really bad even just sneeze as well um that's crazy so you like you guys don't get tornadoes in California is 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 that correct the weather here is just so random I remember it very well I don't know where you are in the UK and you do not need to share that with me that's personal but I do remember London and I just, uh, yeah, I remember like it'd be sunny one second, then I need to get out my umbrella the next second. It wouldn't like pour down rain, but uh, yeah, I, I definitely remember like being in sunshine, being in a sunny patch and everyone's like crowding around in the sun and it's so lovely. And then oh, it's like sprinkling now. Quick, grab out, grab out, grab out the umbrellas and go for a run. The state average is less than 20 a year. Oh, but you get them. I've never experienced anything like that. I feel like a tornado would be terrifying. We've had like maybe one earthquake in the whole history of here. (laughs) And uh, nothing like that. I just think a tornado would be terrifying to me. Uh, I'm not really near London. More the southwest of the UK. Oh, southwest. Need to think in my brain is that way. Interesting. Ooh. I didn't get to go around to that area. Hayley! Oh my gosh. Thank you so much. It's your birthday. What are you doing? (laughs) Happy birthday. Isn't it officially your birthday now too? Has the the time zone now clicked over for you? Happy birthday, Hayley. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much for the four months. I love you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, I hope you are having a wonderful birthday, or about to. Uh, it's too dry. First night in LA was almost 40 years. Oh, right, right, right. In SoCal, it's less than two every four years. Less than two every four years. 
but it's the first tornado in almost 40 years. That's still wild to me. Like, I've never experienced anything like that. That's wild to me. I, I think a tornado would, would terrify me. A tornado experience would just... Oh, my gosh. Oh, they are very scary and don't happen here, so it's crazy they're starting to happen. Right, right, right. Yeah, I feel like I'll be so scary. That's mental. Like, the people who live in those areas wild i guess oh my gosh oh sebo thank you so much welcome to the kinship oh my gosh i'm so excited to have you here thank you so 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 much i really appreciate it <laughs> it has it's 3 20 a.m hi Haley. thank you listen i'm gonna need to throw this back at you though Ooh, oh it's loading hold on hold on let me just throw a little bit of this back at you Haley, because it is your birthday my goodness, happy birthday, my lovely. I know it's 3.20 a.m. for you, and I know that you are a night shift person, so you are probably awake. But if you need to sleep to be prepared for normal time birthday stuff, <laughs> please go get your rest. But oh my goodness, happy birthday, I could just wish you so much. <laughs> oh, they destroy everything in their path. Here I am going, woo, and you've just said to an who's destroy everything in their path. They would, they would. There's like, whew, I just can't imagine. My brain would just, and my heart would just, I think I'd like have, have a full panic attack or a heart attack and not even survive the experience because I'd be like, what the hell is happening? Deserved? Love your vibe. It's amazing. Oh, Seppo, thank you so much. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, now my cheeks are really red. I super appreciate that. Welcome to the kinship. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Like Kentucky gets an average of 200 a year? What the heck? Oh my gosh, that's insane. And I might never go to Kentucky. <laughs> That sounds scary. Um, wow, Kentucky people are survivors. Holy shite. Do you like the sippy moat, Kaylee? That's 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 the sippy moat. It's just been approved. It's brand new. The sippy moat, I feel like it can be real sassy. Like a real sassy sippy moat. I'm looking forward to seeing you use that more and more. <laughs> Most are F3, 4, but they get a 5 grade tornadoes too. Jesus. That's intense. And I would probably mentally not survive that. So that's crazy. That's intense. Yee, I love you. I love you, Dwayley. Well, places that get them don't have a lot of people around those areas. That was not funny. <laughs> that was not funny. <laughs> I don't know. I feel like you could have been making a joke, but I don't think you were. That's not funny. I shouldn't have laughed. I'm sorry. I think that was one of those nervous laugh moments. Um, <clears throat> I can imagine there wouldn't be many people living there because it would be a scary place to live. I love it. I'm still waiting for the the No You One. It's it's there. The No You One is there. It's waiting for approval. No You is coming. It's like, it's coming. If, if these two... The fire and the, what was the other one? The the devil, evil rather. If those two have been approved, I do not see why the no you one wouldn't be. But it is taking a dang long time to get approved. Um, so it is coming. Unless they disapprove it. I don't see why they would. But it's coming. <laughs> Happy birthday, Haley. Yes. Thank you, Seppo. I bet she appreciates that. Oh, look, thank you. Right there. She, she appreciates it. <laughs> big happy birthday it's a belt that goes through kentucky and a couple of other southern states that normally get around holy twelve thousand to f no hold on 1200 not twelve thousand. <laughs> One thousand two hundred to 1400 tornadoes a year that's tornado season in the southern belt is very trippy i can imagine that sounds like a dang light and i don't know that i really want to be around there when that happens um so I think that they're very brave for living out there, but that's not the kind of place that I want to be in. So I may never visit Kentucky and the areas thereabouts. I don't even know if Kentucky have a southern accent. I don't know where that came from, but there you go. There's a southern accent. <laughs> oh, my gosh. What is that, Haley? What is that? Oh, my gosh. That is terrifying. That is a duck head with some muscly legs. 
What is that? <laughs> what is that? That is scary. Most states in the southern region own bunkers. I would hope that they do. I hope that they have somewhere safe to be. Insurance is cheap because of the regular damage. Damn. Damn. Maybe it's just a weird emote and I love it. Oh, it's a goose. Yep, I see. It is a goose. It's not a duck. I can see that now. Far out. It's scary. It's <laughs> oh my gosh. What scares me? What scares you, Brad? Is it the tornadoes? They seem they seem to be very scary. <gasps> what is that? Oh, that is so cute. It's a fox in a box. Oh my gosh. It is a fox in a box. That is adorable. That is freaking adorable. Oh my gosh. Guys, I was gonna I was gonna share some really exciting news. Oh my god, you're killing me, Haley. What is that one? That is too cute. That is too cute. These foxy moats, it's too cute. Uh, what scares you is that California has been known for having next to zero natural disasters for inclement weather. I guess the fires don't count. <laughs> news? We like news. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Okay, so. There is a, I guess you could call it an indie game. And uh, Seppo, actually, and Haley, you guys would know who made the game because it is a member of Watson's community. Um, an indie game that has been made that I voice acted in. And it released yesterday, two days ago for me, but yesterday because of American versus Australian time zones. So this little indie game is now playable. Um, I don't think it's too far developed uh, because I know, for instance, it was like, it's the, it's the alpha launch. You can play this game. Um, the dev is looking for a bunch of feedback and stuff, but you can play this game and I voice a character in it. I voiced the queen of the dead, like, like, like the mistress of the underworld, I guess. And um, uh, the dev told me he's waiting on like the final art before putting her into the game. So she's not in there yet. But I'm pretty damn excited. So you can play a game. And um, not that I sound very professionally voicing right now. But that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool that you can play a game and you can hear my voice as a character. It's pretty wild. So um, I should have made a command or something. But I will give you the link because... Guys, it's freaking awesome, and this dev has done amazing work on it. So I think it needs to be shared anyway, just to celebrate someone's artistic endeavor. Like, it's freaking awesome. So I will, I will share the link. I will share the link real quick. I need to remember how it goes. I think it's uh this. Yes, actually, it is this. Um, mm -mm 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 that's what it is. That's what it is. It's a game called Noia, and it's very exciting. And I. Even if I wasn't in it, I think I'd want to champion it anyway because, like, watching how this game has developed, because um, he's been releasing, like, devlogs on YouTube and stuff, watching how it's been developed and worked on, it's really cool. It's actually really, really cool. It's this sweet side-scrolling pixel art game. Um, it's adorable because I actually told my boss about it and then my boss told his two sons and now his sons have like watched all the devlogs and they cannot wait to play. <laughs> they are so excited. My boss even said to me, Brianna, you're like my, my little superstar. Like my kids are like, tell us more, tell us more. It's adorable. It's so cute. Let me catch up on chat. So sorry, so sorry. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, with... Which, with the changes in climate, are already causing issues from just the heavy rain. We're getting a lot of rain, too, at the moment. But we are in El Nino? El Nino. So we and, like, the Brazil area share a weather event. So whatever they have, we have the opposite of. And I cannot remember which is which, but, like, El Nino, El Nino. I think, I think we're in El Nino. I think the girl is rain and the boy is, like, drought-ish. Oh my gosh, I can't remember which one's which. But we have the rain one. <laughs> so we're getting a lot of rain at the moment. Ooh, yes it is. Ooh. Our infrastructure isn't built for heavy rain. 
Uh, we don't have proper drainage. Oh my gosh. And we also don't have bunkers for tornadoes and hurricanes. So if we start getting those, it'll be devastating. Yeah, man, that's wild. I mean, I can hope that the Californian government wants to support you with that and help and fix your streets and stuff. I can keep my fingers and toes crossed for you to, uh, that they do. That is a lot of hype. Yes, Hayley, thank you so much. It's so exciting. I'm excited. I'm so excited. I think it's going to be so weird playing a game and then hearing my voice and be like, <laughs> what? <laughs> That's me. <laughs> it's weird. That's pretty cool. Thank you, Seppo. California is slowly becoming a second Florida. Damn. The Atlantic is warmer, so hurricanes, yep, are much bigger. And it's five landfall on the eastern coast. Damn. The link does not work. I think that is the link. Um, but I believe the dev is hosting the server within his own office at the moment. Um, it's got like over 500 people on a wait list and, and, and currently over a hundred people playing it. I think I'm not fully sure, but I would say it's just because, um, the game is linked to the server he's personally hosting. So it might just be off at the moment. Um, I believe it is nighttime for them right now. It's definitely nighttime for you guys. I think Brad just said it's 3 a.m. or something. So, um, if the dev is somewhere in that time zone, he'll be sleeping. So I assume the server is off, but that is the link. I appreciate you guys checking it out. Hurricanes from around the Mexican coast often die out on their, on our coast. Well, hold on. Read again. Hurricanes from around the Mexican coast often, but die out on our coast, the Pacific water is just too cold but now that the water is warming oh i see i see i see they i know el nino is a boy and el nino is a girl i meant that i'm not sure which one we're in i know el nino is a boy and el nino is a girl i know that much i know that much i just can't remember if el nino is the weather one i mean sorry it is weather whether it's the raining one or the drought one i just can't remember but we're in the raining one Maid Kate! I also want to call you Matakade. <laughs> How are you, my lovely? It is so lovely to see you. Hello, hello. Maybe, maybe Maid Kate can remember which one we're in. Are we in El Nino or are we in El Nino? Because I can't remember. Um, but we have rain. So we have rain. It's okay, though, because um, despite all that, any given day could be the one. Oh, my gosh. The <laughs> tornado, tornado, tornado. Haley, that feels like that represents you so perfectly as a chaotic storm. No idea. <laughs> I don't remember either. I know we're in the rain one. I just can't remember if El Nino is rain or drought or El Nino is rain or drought. I feel like I should just look this up. But we're in one of them with the rain. Oh, it's so lovely to see you back, my lovely. Um, so that was news number one, actually. It was nice weather today in Melbourne. <gasps> Heck yeah. We had a lot of rain this morning and then it got sunny. But sunny means it gets steamy. So it got quite hoo -hoo -hoo at one point today. Every Californian, uh, every Californian lives with the potential of dread every day. Oh gosh. <laughs> Who, me? Yes, you, Haley. You are the perfect chaotic little storm. So that little tornado emote perfectly represents your absolute little perfect chaotic personality <laughs> undetectable and unpreventable the weather changing damn yeah it's always steamy with you around ah oh, why Haley? i think that's a no you it's always steamy with you around <laughs> um but yeah being in a game was news number one you can play a game and my character that I voice is in it. Very weird, but very exciting. And then news number two. I have a housemate. Yay. We now, I can't remember if I said this in the last stream, but I was sharing. I remember that I was worried because there's three rooms in this house. I already have one great housemate. I was worried he was going to go into that third room. But as it turns out, I happen to know one, someone. Happened to know someone looking for a place to live. And I was like, do you want to, this room, like, you'd fit in great here. And they were like, you know what? I got you. I like this place. Let me live here. And I'm like, okay, <laughs> so much better. Because um, the ad that my landlord put up was just a little bit scary. Um, yeah, I, I, 
they were explaining someone with the complete opposite habits to my housemate and I that are currently here. And that's all I'll say. Like, I'm not going to go into too much detail. But the landlord posted an ad about this third room looking for, like, essentially the exact opposite to the kind of person who would fit into our current dynamic. So I was very worried. And my mum was also very worried. She's like, I'm getting nightmares of the kind of person who's going to come into the room and live with you. And I'm like, I know, I know, I know, I know. So thankfully, 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 someone I know well and will trust with this space is moving in. And I work with this person. So um, part of my job involves sitting in a Google Meet with a bunch of my colleagues um, because we do a lot of stuff. But we're monitoring essentially uh, a, a sports broadcast, um, over a hundred of them sometimes. <laughs> So we're all sitting there monitoring something in a Google Meet and my boss comes barreling into the Google Meet. He just goes, Brianna, I just had the weirdest call. And I'm like, oh, okay. Well, all right. Thinking, am I in trouble? Like, what is this weird call that, that has just occurred? And he said, um, um, he said, um, your real estate agent just called me looking for a reference for the other person moving in because I work with the other person. And I was like, oh, okay, yeah, that's actually my private landlord. And I don't know why I said that, but I did. And my boss goes, oh, you want to be living with so-and-so? And I'm like, yeah. And he goes, oh, my God, that's amazing. And it was just so random that my boss comes barreling into our call. We're all, like, focused. We're all like, okay, that soccer's working well. Oops, that rugby league, you know, the internet where the operator is isn't working so well. All right, how do I fix that? Like, we're all in business mode and he just goes I just had the weirdest call okay <laughs> it was very fun the San Andreas fault line it runs through the state I missed what that was in reference to possibly natural disasters and I hope it doesn't occur for you Brad no you no you Haley no you the biggest fault line in the world oh right right any day could slip and the dreaded big one hit Woo, we could literally have drills for it in every, well, we literally have drills for it in every school. So do you mean like, um, by fault line, do you mean, uh, like an earthquake could happen at any point? That's exciting. Thank you, Haley. And I see your hydrate. I will have a hydrate. I will have a hydrate. I will hydrate now. I will have a hydrate. <laughs> I will have a hydrate. Thank you. Amazing. I actually needed that because it turns out I've been talking so much more than I intended to. I got really excited and spurted out all the information. <laughs> yep, the, I can't really do the magic because uh, I should, I should, um, I should get into Minecraft. But I did enjoy the Minecraft magic of me, my little, sc my little face screen, and then like pulling the torch out of the game. Not that that actually, you know, it's magic. It's magic, okay? Um. Yeah, the Minecraft torch bottle. <laughs> I want it in a comp. Might as well use it. Let me that bottle. I forgot you had that. Mm -hmm. Like I said, I want it in a competition. Might as well use it now. Historically, about every 250 years, the fault line does a big shift, resulting in a nine plus earthquake that in the past didn't do much because there wasn't much here. Oh, yes. But now you have big towns. Big cities, big civilization points. That's real rough. It's well past its time, so it could happen whenever. Oh, well, I can hope that it doesn't for you. And I know that's not realistic because, of course, it's going to happen at some point. But I can still hope and cross my fingers and plait my hair and cross my toes and uh, I hope it doesn't happen for you. Okay, so I'm going to bed. I love you lots. Have an amazing stream. I love you too, Haley. Get some good sleep. And I hope you have an amazing birthday celebratory day when you wake up tomorrow. One more time, I'm going to have to send you some love. And the happy birthday card. A little bit of this, a little bit of that. A little of this, a little of that. One of these, one of that. One of these, one of these, one of that, one of these. One of these, one of these, one of that, one of these. Some of these, one, two, one more. <laughs> okay, that'll do. <laughs> I have all the emotes. <laughs> Happy birthday. I hope it's an amazing day. I hope it's so good. And uh, we're getting old. 
You're not. You are immortalized as never aging. But I'm feeling it. The years are ticking by, man. <laughs> oh my gosh. Get an amazing sleep and have an amazing birthday. Okay, 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 okay. So, news aside. Okay, hold on. I see a big message. I'll read that. That type of power these days would level buildings. The good thing for California, it has only the... It is is it has been the only thing to worry about but all the buildings made in the last hundred years have been up to code to withstand earthquakes especially more so in the last 40 years well that's something that's something hopefully that means like the damage is minimized then <laughs> love you, yeah right <laughs> okay love you i love you too have good sleeves happy birthday Mwah. okay 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 minecraft will happen now. Minecraft will happen now. Okay, I was not on point. But there you go. Minecraft! All right! <laughs> oh, thank you so much for the follow. Let me see if I can say this. Polytomen? 2106? <laughs> Welcome to the kinship, Polytomen. It is lovely to have you here. You've not played Minecraft in so long, Seppo? Oh my gosh. Let me show you what we have been doing because I'm really excited about this. And if you're feeling any kind of nostalgia right now, hold on, I'm lagging. Only when the game starts. Only when the game starts. Come on, game. Let's go. Do your thing. 100%. Let's go. Come on. There we go. There we go. Um, If you're feeling any kind of nostalgia for Minecraft right now, then potentially, potentially you will like this. So, my project I'm working on in Minecraft right now is a downloadable adventure map. I have a lot to do. Literally, whatever number I said, 28. Day 28 in my title. <laughs> I've been working on this for 28 days, which I just so happens to be the amount of streams I've done. I've only done 29 to 30 streams in my entire life. So there's also that. It's a nice way of keeping track of where I'm up there. That is a downloadable adventure map. We are going to figure out how to put in bosses, traps, lore. Not sure about a well, not sure about an economy system. That one might be a little bit harder. But basically, think D and D in Minecraft. I am building the adventure map, and it's doing it's doing okay. It's doing okay. We're 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 doing things. So. Let me show, hold on, let me, let, we'll, surprise, we'll show you, <laughs> I can't see where I'm going, surprise, we'll show you some things if you would like to see it. But evidence from the San Fran quake of 1906 from the 0, 8.0 that happened then was carnage, holy moly, I can imagine. Uh, how are you guys? Hey Aragon, how are you doing? It is lovely to see you back. I hope you're doing well. Uh, the quake in 1989 was like a seven and destroyed the city. Damn. Okay, okay, okay. So this is the kind of thing um, we've been working on. I am very detail orientated. This has happened in... I have no stamina. <laughs> this has happened all in survival because I like to torture myself. Um, but yeah, things are happening. It's looking good. This is just the bridge. I was trying to show you the edge of the bridge. Hold on, hold on, hold on. We're building a bridge. <laughs> it's getting there. It's getting there. And uh, and uh, as far as medieval city goes, the city's not really there yet. We're just kind of in the farming district area. But, but this is our farming district section. Let me, let me real quick. Let me, I'm going to give you a tour now. I hope you don't mind. I'm going to give you a real quick tour because um, I'm getting excited by the things we've been building here. So we've got a little campfire with uh with a uh, like like a little camping spot it's looking real cute i think it's real cute i know i'm biased but you know it's looking real cute we have a farmer's house which um did my head in for some reason <laughs> with like i don't know the details for that farmer's house were not happening for me for some strange reason but it has come together now and look there it is it's doing all right now it's much much better i think the, uh, the tower, I think, was what was really throwing me off. Um, so there's a little farmer's house. We have a little barn. Nope, never mind. Take that back. Not a barn. Stable. We have a stable. 
These trees are not staying, by the way. I just wanted to have some spruce trees. But we have a stable. And it's looking real cute. We got a pig pen. It's looking real cute. And uh, today's project, we'll be finishing off the cow pen, which is this one here. And potentially thinking about sheep and chickens. So... Yeah, that's what we're doing. <laughs> um, did I, did I, did I, did I, did I, did I, yep. By the way, Aragon, I'm doing really well, thank you. I hope you are as well. Uh, you have arrived. Hey, Blue Milk, how's it going? It's so good to see you. Um, my brain short-circuited because I was about to mention the fact that, I don't know. Daylight savings has happened. <laughs> now we're in the same time zone. Fortunately for me, in my 25 years of life, the worst quake ever experienced was like a 6.4. And that only lasted for a couple seconds. Dang. <laughs> you think you're getting sick again? Oh my goodness, Brad. If you need to take care of yourself, please do so. Do I have carrots on me? Um, there's a random piggy that needs to join. Nope. Wrong hand. Join. <laughs> The family of piggies. Stay here, piggies. I go get your friend. Where is it? Here it is. Hey, piggy, 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 piggy. You want to join a family? Oh, and there's a bunny. Do you want a carrot too? Wait, I don't have much experience with the bunnies. Do the bunnies like carrots? Do the bunnies like carrots? That was a stupid question. Do you actually? <laughs> okay. I learned something. <laughs> That's cute. Okay. Um, cool. Um, except that the bunny right now, I don't need it. I will maybe make you a... Okay, you can't hop. Cool. There's another piggy. Hold on. Hi. Come join family. Hi. Come on. What away. <laughs> Man, does savings really caught up to me today. So thrown off. It, I think it caught up to me as well. Like, um... I don't know, maybe the first few days for me were not that detrimental. Come on, everybody, this way. This way. Come through the little gate. You can do it like this. Hello, come on. Come on. Come through the gate. Come through the gate. Good job. Good job. You want some babies? Some baby time? Bam, bam, bam. Bam, bam, bam. Bam, 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 um, yeah, daylight savings today, I think, caught up to me. I'm definitely more tired than I am used to being. Come on. Up, up, up. In, in, in. Good job. Good job. All right, cool. Thanks, guys. Stay here. Be a family. You are probably actually overcrowding. <laughs> I mean, I don't want to think about that. Um, but yes, today it has kicked my little patootie. <laughs> You work at nine and you can't sleep? Damn, Brad, if you need to sleep, go on. If you're feeling unwell especially, unless unless you think it's unwell enough to like call in sick, then that might be different. But dude, get the sleep you need. Can I like do this and then that? Nope. Nope. I learned something new. But maybe I can do that. I can do that. That's helpful. Sort of, not really. But it's, it's a thing. Okay. I don't know. I, I, I just, I'm, hmm. <laughs> that might have to be one of those mud blocks. We'll come back for that. Or a pod soul or something. Something. Okay, okay, okay. You're far too creative. I usually just turn a tunnel into a, into, into a, whoa. Let me try reading that again. I usually just tunnel into a hill and make a house. Oh, but that's that's creative too. Like you're still putting expression into that. Speaking of tunnels, though, there was one last thing. Can I show you? There's one last thing. And when I figure out how to put shaders on, because for some reason the Optifine isn't downloading for me, so it's not really working. I don't I don't understand it. But speaking of tunnels, this is gonna look real cool when shaders happen. But down here, we have made a super cute overgrown tunnel. Look at it. It's so cute. Like, look at this. Isn't this adorable? Um, this was a 
a suggestion actually by someone in the community and it has turned out so nicely so 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 nicely there it is look look it looks so good and then like this yes it looks so good i'm i this is one of my favorite places right now it's just it feels nice it feels really nice um but digging into a like tunneling into a hill and building a home is still expressive okay i also just wanted to check that you're still there cool i mean you're sitting there's no way you could go but still <laughs> just had to check um thank you i appreciate you calling me creative it's a lot of practice <laughs> a lot of not having much time for much else so why not minecraft <laughs> oh my gosh um i was so tired and everyone at work just couldn't be bothered either i feel that man i feel that quite a bit although today was the day that we we moved like the last the place i work we're moving we had an office rent ended got a storage shed have been working from home now i have a new office so we were taking stuff from the storage shed into the new office um thankfully i didn't have to do any of it i sat and staffed people <laughs> like gave shifts to other people i mean um but the boys, the boys pulled up their sleeves and they they carried stuff. Mind you, that's not to say that I didn't want to help or that I couldn't. Because the last time we moved, I did help and I was very strong. But um, in this particular case, one of my bosses, because I have two, I know. One of the bosses was like, no, nah, I need you to staff people. So I just sat there like, tapping on my computer. <laughs> These guys are like carrying tables and chairs past me. And I'm like, sorry. <laughs> um, so I, I got very lucky. Is the point of me saying that I got very lucky? Um, okay, okay, okay. What am I looking for? Hey, I've got it here. Hey, I know what I'm looking for. <laughs> We're gonna need so much more than that, though. Oh my gosh, I am well. Anything interesting happen today? <gasps> Blue milk. Yes, I have something interesting to tell you. I'll come back to that. Well, it's the lazy side of creative. <laughs> I see what you mean. Look, I can get behind that. I can get behind that for sure uh you love it you love the un underground what happened did the did the did the did, did the bunny go up and fall <laughs> what happened Whoa! oh that's really sad is that what happened did the bunny just like hop 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 and then fall Poor bunny. Oh, that's really sad. No poor bunny. Um, if you're referring to loving the underground tunnel, then I really appreciate it. I think it turned out really nicely. An underground city! Oh, thanks for the idea. Oh, are you going to build an underground city? Or are you re referring to... Suggesting to me to build an underground city? Because if you build an underground city, that would be freaking awesome. And I want to see how you go. That would be really, really cool. Hi, Sanfi. Welcome in. I unfortunately do not speak that, so I cannot tell you. Um, but welcome in, and it's lovely to have you here. Sorry, not sorry. Sorry, not sorry. What are you referring to? Suggesting to me to make an underground city or something else? I'm not too sure. Rip bunny. I know. You think like I didn't kill it? I didn't do it. It wasn't me. I think it like jumped up one of these and fell off, and that's really sad. <laughs> rip, <laughs> rip, yep, big rip, big rip. Bit of a column A, bit of a column B. Nah, too. Is that too much work? Are you about to say nah? Too much work. Well, you could do it in creative mode, and it's not as bad. So if you do want to do it. Definitely hop into creative. And then uh, there are commands. Like if you want to do an underground city, um, there are commands you can do, which I can help you with this if you like, in which uh, you can run a command. Really easy to do. And it's like from point A to point B. And suddenly, bam, it's all gone. So you can hollow out a mountain, let's say, very quickly. Oh, I'm stuck. Um... So, 
if you wanted to do it underground city in creative mode, I mean, sorry, let me try that again. <laughs> if you wanted to do an underground city, it would not be as bad as you might think. Um, being new to Minecraft might be like still a, a moment of getting used to it, but you can do it in creative mode, which means you do not need to collect your resources. You can just build with unlimitless supplies and yeah, do it. I think you should do it. Definitely do it. I want to see it. We can, we could build an underground city like you build one and I build one and we can, um, no, we're not going to compare because yours would be amazing because you built it. It's as simple as that. Um, we could co-build is the word I'm looking for. <laughs> we need mud. I know we need mud. I know, I know, I know, I know. Let me get the hay going and then we can, we can start on stuff like that. You might need to remind me how to make mud actually. I might have forgotten. Oh, we need a brewing stand. That's what we needed. Right. That's why we haven't done it yet. Okay. Okay. Um. Okay. 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 There is a village nearby. I don't know if it has a brewing stand, but we can go have a look. You're going to make your own Uther turn. Oh my gosh. Yes. Oh my gosh. Make your own Uther turn. That would be so cool. Did you watch the most recent episode of Critical Role? We we're talking about Critical Role for anyone who might not know. The scene of them walking through the city, and that's all I'll say in case people have not watched it and do not want spoilers. But the scene of them walking through the city. Oh my gosh. Tears. Just happy tears. What a beautiful moment. Oh no. Don't. Okay, cool. I thought it was going to... Um take the seeds out and then I'd need to get a hoe and I don't got a hoe on me so where are we at I need more my goodness so much so much so much wheat needed to make hay bales so much and I'm doing it the slowest way probably but I don't want to ruin the aesthetic <laughs> so it's just one two three four so in the meantime how are you guys doing oh yes blue milk I have that exciting news to share with you there's a mod called Effortless Building that's survival friendly. Oh, and it's a fast pace uh, block placer. Ooh, that might be worth looking into. I would really like to do this vanilla. But I understand things like this right now. Smash wheat, smash wheat, smash wheat. Like that's probably not super interesting as a viewer to watch. I'm not sure. Maybe it is. Maybe you guys don't mind. It's definitely a moment that gives opportunity for me to talk to you guys and just hang out. But realistically, watching me go smash wheat, smash wheat, smash wheat might not be the most interesting. I don't know. That could be a mod worthy of looking into. Um, maybe you guys can decide or something. <laughs> I don't know. Um, you haven't finished the episode. Okay, 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 okay. But the city of it is the best. Okay, okay, you haven't finished the episode yet, so I, 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 I won't, I won't, I won't spoil a thing, but just you wait. I mean, it's Critical Role. How could you expect anything less than something incredible? But you just wait. You just wait, my friend. I want to say so much more, but I won't, I won't, I won't, I won't, I won't spoil it. <laughs> we need gunpowder as well. Okay, I do believe I have that, so that's good. If we need a brewing stand... We can start with that after we have our hay bales. Andreas, hey, how are you doing? Uh, lovely to have you in. How is your day going? Actually, I don't know where you are. Is it maybe nighttime? It could be. Not sure. <laughs> I hope you're well regardless of what time of day it is. Sc scam? <laughs> What's a scam, Aragorn? Okay, okay, okay. So, that exciting news, right? There is an indie game that has come out. It is in alpha phase, alpha testing, alpha something, sorry, but it's in an alpha launch. That's the word I'm looking for. Um, it's in an alpha launch and I voiced a character in it. So the character that I voiced is not yet a part of the game that you can play. It's still being developed, but I voiced a character in it and it's really cool. And I think, I think the character that I voiced uh, will be available really soon, I think. I'm not fully sure. I'm not going to speak out of term if that's not correct. <gasps> but it's really freaking cool to be able to say, 
I voiced a character in a motherfucking game. Ah! Sorry. But ah! <laughs> the excitement is just wild. It's out of here. It's crazy. Um, I can give you a link for you guys to, sh to check it out. I do believe it's not currently active because the dev of the game is running the server uh, privately. So I don't believe the server is on. But I can share that with you guys and it's super exciting. So the game, it's called Noia. N O I A. <laughs> and it's really exciting. So I'm really excited. If you didn't notice, I'm very excited. It's really cool. It's really cool. <laughs> I'm good. Sleepy. Oh, it's noon there. What does that make it? You're on maybe the UK side. Oh, no, actually, we established this maybe. So many seeds. I do not need this many seeds, man. Uh, but midday. Feeling sleepy? Maybe you need a nap. I can't not nap, so I'm very jealous of anyone who can. Wait, I'm not making bread. Whew, we're not making bread. We are not doing that. We are doing this. That was close. I nearly wasted so much wheat then. Okay, we're fine. We're safe. <laughs> oh, you're halfway through the fight. Right, right, right. You're halfway through the fight of that episode. Well, then. Exciting. Exciting. Very exciting. Very sure. I really want to spoil stuff, but I'm not gonna. <laughs> um, oh, you're from Belgium. I thought you must have been somewhere from around there. So you mean, that wasn't the right way to say that. I thought you must have been from around there somewhere. <laughs> That's really cool. Lovely to have you here from Belgium. And I'm doing well, thank you. So yeah, my exciting news was the uh, was the game. And that's just got me like super hyped and and just bubbly. Um, I mean, I'm pretty <laughs> I'm a pretty hyped bubbly person anyway. But that's got me like over the edge, you know. So, um, yeah, I'm really excited about that. I can finally say I know someone who voiced a character. Precisely. It's true. It's very true. That happened. You can do that. You can say you know someone who voiced a character. And hello, it's me. I did it. I did the thing. And it's so exciting. <gasps> I'm so excited. It's really, really cool. Um, this part probably makes more sense to have straw. And I should do this with my shovel, but apparently I do things the hard way. <laughs> so there you go. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's noon there too? Oh, nice. Hmm, do I want... It is not noon here. It is 8pm. So it is dark and it's wintry. And I'm getting excited for using a hot water bottle. I love taking hot water bottles to bed. I think we need more and I'm not quite sure where I want to put it. Maybe here? Sun's going down again. Um, uh, Let's start with that because <coughs> I want things in other places as well. Uh, okay, 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 okay. Okay, I thought it was. All right, never mind. Um, I told my boss about voicing a character, and he has two young sons. I think they're one's barely a teenager, and the other one might still be a kid. Um, apparently, they think it's freaking awesome, and they want to play this game. And I just think that's so cute. I think that's really, really cute. Okie dokie. So, whilst I have this hibbel to my hand, we need to fix a little of this as well. Um, yeah, I, was I feel like this one can be a little bit more random. <laughs> we we can just do a bit of this, and however it ends up is how it ends up, you know. Do 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 do. Randomness. Here we are. I'm here for it. Um, so long as it's not too high, maybe I should put some like leaves and other decorations inside it. It's out of space. Maybe. Hmm. It's kind of annoying you can't put it under... 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 Um, <coughs> you can't put the path under it, is the words I'm trying to say. Okay. Um, 
it works. It's a, it's it's there. It does a thing. It's it's a, it's it works kind of. You know, I think it's more like like um maybe my like, uh, we might need to come back and build up the hay bales because it makes more sense for this hail hail hay 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 to go up. <laughs> but here we are. We can add a little bit whilst we're here, and then. And then and then and then we can we can go have a look for a brewing stand and try some mud. It's gonna be interesting. I never made mud actually. Excuse me. Beep beep. Beep. Excuse me. Oh, we're still a little too randomized. Um, hmm. we might need this one and maybe like these two. Bam. Bam. Maybe, 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 one here. Okay, I only had one. <laughs> so there we go. Um, all right, well, there we go. Where are we at? Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. So, I think, I think, I think, I think, it could be a good time to go and get a brewing stand and try this. Actually, let's keep that on me. Um, try this thing that you're talking about because it sounds real cool. Uh, you should be in that one. <laughs> um, 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 where we need to go, we'll have that. Might as well take that with us and that with us because it's back in the other house. And then we can leave this there, and this here is fine. And maybe we'll throw in, I don't know. That'll do. What else have we got? Thank you very much. Hey, you want to go for a ride? Let's go for an adventure. Well, I'm thinking about it. Maybe we should take the bed as well. Because uh, I don't want it to be night suddenly. And me stuck out in the middle of nowhere. So, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Hay bale entrance mat. Hay bale under the gate. I could. I could put a hay bale under the gate. But I'm thinking maybe it'll be a puzzle slash um gravel slash mud situation under the gate so we shall see we shall see um i've been working on some secret stuff too not a lot um but this being a downloadable <coughs> adventure map eventually for you guys then, then, there's going to be some secrets. So, I have been working on a few little cute little things. Some of it I will get to show you. There was just like parts of it I needed to build separately for the secret part of it. And then parts of it around the secret I can show you. So, I'm excited to share with you one little thing I've been working on. It looks really cool. Um, but other stuff will have to remain a secret. And... It's still exciting. It's still exciting. <laughs> uh, take some colored fireworks. Oh my goodness, that scared me. <laughs> Ashella, hey, welcome in. It is so lovely to have you here. Welcome to the kinship. Hello, hello. How are you doing? Hey, Ash. <laughs> you were asking about the fireworks. I think I do not have any left. I think we might have used them all. Yes, definitely. How are you, Ash Jello? I hope you're doing well. Okay, this is my favorite part. It's not. That's a joke. It's my favorite part. Going through trees on horseback. That's a sheep. That actually confused my brain. I didn't know what that was going to be. Ooh, we might go further around. Like, like, like further around. Like this much further around. And then back around. And then, oh dear. <laughs> Oh no, I might have actually done a bad thing. Hold on. Hold on. You doing great? How are you? How am I, rather? <laughs> I'm doing fantastic, thank you, Ash Jello. Except for the part where I'm struggling a little bit with my horse through the trees. Uh, there was... I haven't been to this village in so long that I've forgotten the best way through. The sheep's going to show me how to do it. Of course, the sheep is much shorter, so <laughs> there's also that. Okay, there we go. Um, the village is right up there. Man, come on. 
Why are you gonna be so difficult? Let's go this way then. And then this way. There we go. There we go. That's the way to do it. Much better. Much better. <laughs> so much better. Whee! This way. Thank you. Great. And that way. Great. There we go. I don't remember if there's a brewing stand in here though. So we're about to find out. Jump. Okay, this looks far enough to set you down, so let's do that. Stay here. No adventuring. <laughs> I'm great. It's great. You're great. It is great that all of you are great. You gotta do it at least once. Right. Houses. There were some lower down. Yeah, here it is. There it is. There it is. I think this is a library, though. Yes, it is a library. Say Eldritch Blast. <laughs> Say Eldritch Blast in that accent. Eldritch Blast. I don't know where I'm picking this accent up from. I just, I don't even think it's that good. Not that you're saying it's good. I'm just saying it's definitely not. Then I just can't stop doing it. Uh, wait, you're definitely not. You're definitely not what I'm looking for. <laughs> Um, houses this way? Yes. Houses this way. Brewing stand? Nope. Houses this way? No. Brewing stand, please. Otherwise, I don't know where I'm going to get one from. Because I don't think I've seen another village yet. This is the only one. And I'm going the long way around. Of course I am. Brewing? Brewing? Nope. Up here? Brewing stand? Nope, that's a house. Brewing stand? I think they're from little cathedrals now, aren't they? You know what? I'll take them. Why not? Free spruce, thanks. Very much appreciated. Um. Hey! You having fun? You like your little, you like your little spot? Yeah? Is it fun? Would you like me to close it up for you? Here you go. There you are. Yeah? Happy? <laughs> oh my gosh. So great. Very great. Oh my goodness. Welcome to the Kinship Zonkos. It is so lovely to have you here. I hope you are doing very well. Yeah, Aragorn. I, I believe this one does not have a, what do you call it? A church. I don't think it has a church. I think we have run out of village. Oh, they're nice and... Well, I think that one's balding a little bit. <laughs> um, okay, 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 okay. Okay, okay, okay. What I'm going to do then... I don't think we have a village. <laughs> I don't think we have a church in this village. So, what I think we will do... Is... We will... That's That's still not a village. Uh, what we will do, still, it is a village, I mean a church. Far out, why can't I? <gasps> <gasps> Hi. Hey. Would you like me to help you escape? Hello, buddy. Are you okay in there? Can I join you? And run free! Oh, so freaking cute. Um, okay. Where did I put the bed? Over this way, I think. I should not have put it down yet. I think it's this way. Oh no, it's somewhere here. Okay, cool, cool. We're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Far out, man. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I love foxes too! I mean, maybe of course, because my name is... <laughs> kind foxes. But I love foxes. Oh, I didn't actually hit the bed. That helps. <laughs> now I'm asleep. Um, they're so cute. And I think Minecraft did a great job of just making these sweet little adorable characters. So, my goodness. I love them so much. Um, I will take the bed now. I'll leave the horse. And we'll, we might... Oh, we can't collect puzzle because we don't have... We don't have silk touch. Um, I keep forgetting that. There's pods all over here and I can't do it because I don't have silk touch. But I believe there's gravel. 
We can maybe do... Uh, nope. No skeleton. Nope. We can maybe do gravel. <sighs> Give him sweet berries. I, I should have. I should have given him sweet berries. Especially while he was standing there with me. Um, let's go around this hole. Good, good, good. You almost cried when you when you saw your first one because it was so damn cute. <gasps> I feel it. Oh, it's not gravel. It's whatever this is. Man. I know Minecraft. <laughs> I know Minecraft so well. Um, Same though, Ash Jello. I feel that. Uh, I get way too attached to animals in games. Um, so I feel that. I really feel that. I was on someone's SMP world as well and I like my friend Haley and I we collected all of the foxes that we possibly could and I guess I'm punching dirt now and and it was a really cute we just had a family of foxes it was so cute oh can I only collect them with a shovel are they breaking now oh no never mind never mind I just must have missed um but also on this SMP I was, I had the, I had the fastest horse on the entire SMP and I was attached to that thing. And then one day I'm, I'm like riding past on my way to like see Haley in the, in the, um, in the SMP and another member of the SMP was shooting chickens nearby. So I didn't see them. Out of nowhere, this arrow comes flying and one shot kills my horse. Yes, it didn't have a lot of health, but it one shot kills my horse. And I remember riding, 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 and then nothing. It's just gone. And I just like... And I burst into tears. <laughs> I'm not kidding. The horse, it died from under me and I burst into tears. I was like, oh my... God, it was awful. And it wasn't their fault. They didn't know I was coming. Like, I don't blame them. It was just like, oh my God, it was awful. <laughs> you love the frogs, Kate? Yes. I haven't actually seen them yet. I need to discover a mangrove. I don't think I have come across a mangrove yet. I will need to go searching for one eventually because I have not yet seen the foxes. Ah, the foxes? The frogs. I have not yet seen the frogs. And it's just got to happen. I have got to see the frogs. It's just got to happen. This is a thing that I need to fix. Um, but I haven't, I haven't been able to do that yet. Um, this is quite a big, like look how big, whoa. I was going to say, look how big the thing is. <gasps> Lush cave. Well, why I don't mind if I do. Hello. Do I have other dirt on me? Just normal dirt? Yes. Good. Okay. Hi, Lush cave. How's it going? Uh, do you have any really cool things for me to steal from you? Because I'm here for it. I'm going to steal everything. Hi. Nope. Cool. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, this is a bit bigger than I thought. Um, no, bad. No, don't. Okay. I'm not very good at fighting things. Fine at building. Fighting, not so much. So it might be a bit of a run in and grab and run out. That looks intimidating too. That looks like a really deep drop. Okay, maybe we can come back when it's safer and I can, I don't know. I don't know what's gonna be safer than the daylight, but <laughs> I'm a wimp. <laughs> you know what is gonna be safer? Proper armor, that's what's gonna be safer. Oh dear, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm not panicking, you are. Okay, all right, I'm panicking, yes. Stop pinning me, stop it. Stop. I'm not good at fighting, okay? Thank you. Right, cool. Huh. Oh yeah. Bad skeleton. No. Bad. Come into the light. You like the lights, don't you? Don't you love it so much? That's why you're so hot right now? Because you love the light. Come in, come 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 closer. Come into the light a little bit more. That's it. I don't know what my head wobble is. Okay, look. Sick of this. 
Damn it. <laughs> Thank you. Well, look, we know this is here. So when I can get better armor, <laughs> it might be time to come back when I can when I can look after myself a little bit more. You also like the light. Come join me in the sunshine. Okay. So this is here. That's cool. Lush cave is freaking awesome. Oh, hold on. I've missed a bunch. Hold on. I was panicking too much. What a weird big bit of biome. This is... Uh, look, like, look, look, look at that. I think this is a massive tiger biome. What the heck? What the actual heck? Exploring in Minecraft is always a wild time. Look how big the trees are. I've actually not seen that many big tiger trees before. I had no idea this was so close. I I'm in the water now. <laughs> went a little too far wow okay that's a lot to explore crazy but hold on i've missed you guys let me just scroll back a little oh no your cousin killed it and you cried more oh i feel that like 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 my little story i feel that so much oh i'm so sorry that happened Bronco's the best mm -hmm. did you punch them into the nether trap <laughs> i feel like it you couldn't since you're creative. Oh no. Trap them in the void. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> Maybe trap them in the void. You just need. I just need one moss block. <laughs> I will do that. <laughs> it's a good idea. Jello. Just collect one moss block. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. I do. I do have some at home. That's partly why I wasn't so panicked. But for you guys, I could be a bit braver. And just grab one. This is, um, this is cool. I didn't realize how big this was. This is cool. I like it. I like it a lot. Mm, I would have liked a village, though. That would have also been very helpful. Anything this way? Hello, big beautiful biome. I hope you're having a wonderful day. <gasps> Jesus. <laughs> That's not fall. Falling is not recommended. Okay. Cool. <laughs> that exists. <laughs> we might not go that way. <laughs> You're back. You're cooking rice palaf. Welcome back, Brad. You missed me panicking. Hello, baby. Hi. I love you so much. Come back. Come back. Where are you? Hi. Oh, I love it when they do that. I love it when they do that. Hi. Hello. One day. One day we're going to have a whole pen of you cuties. And I'm just going to go wild. Uh, you know, I'm just going to love you so much. Every single one of you. It's going to happen. It's going to happen. All right, I'm going to let you sleep. Bye-bye. Was this, was this the right one? Was this the hole? Uh... Why do I feel like I want to play this again? <laughs> Must resist. <laughs> it's a curse, isn't it? Every time you see someone play, there's another one. Ah, it's a baby. <gasps> it's two baby foxes. Oh my gosh. Hold on. Hold the god dang phone. I, 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 I just... Uh, I'm feeling all kinds of feels right now. Look how small they are. <gasps> Look how tiny. Hello. Look how small their tails are compared to mum here. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <gasps> I'm feeling things. I'm feeling so many things. I'm just feeling so many things right now. Whew. Okay. Minecraft is like a curse in that. You see someone play Minecraft and you itch. You want to play too. And no matter your play style, whether you're a hardcore player, hey, or you're a builder like me, or you just like to survive. <laughs> I'm, yeah, yeah. Hi. Hi, babies. Hi, babies. 
Bye. I love you so much. Okay. 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 I'm just going to follow you for a tiny little bit. You're so cute. Um, Minecraft. Watching someone play Minecraft makes you want to Minecraft. Okay, but you're so cute. All right. I'll leave you alone now. Be a happy family. Bye. Um, now's a good time to do that, actually. <laughs> You made some polo asada. It sounds really good. I hope that you like it. I'm not trying to do your accent. Sorry. That was just, I make noises and that's what came out. <laughs> I hope you enjoy it. There's a fly in your room and you can't see it. That is the worst. That mosquito effect. That like, in the back of your brain. And you're like, God damn, I got to find this thing and destroy it. Only I, I can't, I can barely hurt a fly. I'm not even kidding. There's... It hurts. I don't want to do it. I don't like murdering things at all. Is this the hole? Here it is. Here it is? Here it is. Do I have enough dirt to bail me out this time? Yeah, I do. Okay, it's fine. All right. Just some moss. Just some moss. We can we can do this. Just some moss. Oh, hello, zombie villager. If I could protect you, I mean, cure you. Uh, I have got nothing to cure you with, so that's a shame. I can put you out of your misery. That's what I can do. Damn, that would have been awesome. Okay, there's moss here. Let's let's. Oh, I just scared myself. Don't mind me. <laughs> nothing to worry about here. Everything is fine. Okay, I got some moss. Might as well grab some of these. This is fine too. Everything is fine. Okay, I hear you. Bye. I'm out. See you later. There's an enderman. We'll ignore that too. Okay. Bye. 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 Oh. Hey. He. See, I can be brave. <laughs> it can happen sometimes. <laughs> Not that that was super brave. Was that super brave? Yeah. Oh my goodness. Oh. Oh no, I'm missing so much. I'm so sorry. Uh, because who doesn't want that at 3.25 in the morning? The food or the fly in the room? Because I agree. Sweet berries. I didn't have any. Oh my god, it's my goddamn lamp. I can't get my hand in there. <laughs> Baby boxes, oh my god. Screenshot now. Oh man, I'm sorry. I missed that. You are right. I should have screenshot. We will, we will make baby foxes. Do not even worry. Actually, question. If in the wild they can have more than one baby, is there not a cooldown when you breed foxes in Minecraft? Like, can you get two very quick? Or is there still a cooldown if you breed them? Because they can have two at once in the wild. So it stands to reason that there isn't a cooldown for at least two babies. When you breed foxes yourselves. Is that a thing? You used to be fairly into it and you had your own server as well. Self-made one with a spare computer you had. Oh, nice. But I never really did anything. Just made things and tried out mods. Oh, I think unless you have something like this, like, um... Like this, my project, I meant, um, like a, like a, it is tempting to take you. Uh, no, I will not do it because I have these. It is fine. Uh, if you don't have like a project that you're really working on, then what else do you do in Minecraft, right? Unless you have friends and then it's very different. Um... I think it's a very different experience. It's a very different experience doing it alone as a as a, as opposed to someone else. And even then, I don't consider doing this alone because I have you guys. I have your guys' feedback and suggestions and opinions. And I find this very different from just a solo playthrough. It is a playthrough with you guys. So it's, it's different. Um, but that sounds really cool. I don't want rotten flesh, if you don't mind. Thank you very much. Oh no, I'm missing chat. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Can you do markers in Minecraft like other open world games? Uh, I don't think so. Like location markers. I don't think so. You can take down the coordinates like um, I can bring this up and uh, 
right above my right where my head is is where coordinates are right right here this line this one right here that one <laughs> that is where the coordinates are there's xyz coordinates so you can mark down coordinates absolutely which is this one right here you can't see <laughs> um but there's not really a marker it's not really a marker you love watermelon it's so good so do i Kira plays. Hello, how are you doing? It is lovely to have you here. There is a cooldown. What? Well, then that's silly. That's silly. They should be able to have the two. No? <laughs> they should have two babies. I feel ripped off. Hello. Yeah, that's the thing. I never had a plan. Oh, uh, well, I have a question for you then. If you were to open Minecraft right now, sorry, horse, what plan would you go with? What would you create? Would you would you even like play hardcore? Would you go survival? Would you build something? Like what would you do if you opened Minecraft today? Uh. <laughs> um, okay, this is the better way to go. I should have went this way last time. We'll go through this street. No, we won't. We'll go around this tree. We'll go up this tree. And this one. And hut and hut. Sorry. Sorry, horse. Uh, and then, and then, and then this way. And then so many damn trees. And then this way. Now where are we? Perfect. This is where we wanted to be, right? Nice. This is where we wanted to be. Okay. Fantastic. Okay, okay, okay. So, wasn't as successful as we were going for because we need a brewing stand. Didn't happen. There was not one in that village. And I, I was like, hey, we can at least get Podzel. Nope, we cannot because, <laughs> because I don't have silk touch. God damn it. Ah. Hi Kira, thank you for saying hi to everyone Aragon, that's really lovely Oh my god, that screen is so busy What, this one? You mean it doesn't look confusing and wild? <laughs> yeah, it's pretty full on It's like telling you your computer stuff Um, It's also telling you what what biome you're in what what like like i'm looking at lush grass right now i think and now i'm looking at uh now i'm looking at now i'm looking at a log like i think it changes that stuff um and then it tells you everything <laughs> tells you everything so it's a little bit full-on it's crazy <laughs> there's two flies in your lamp no no we do have these guys though so look, 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 look. We do have these guys. They're so cute. So we will definitely be making some babies. It'll happen. It'll happen. Origins mod. Uh, what's the origins mod? Did I need to drop anything off while I'm here? Yes, I did. That's that's the reason why I brought some stuff. So <laughs> stay here. No adventuring. Um... I'd probably end up trying to build something, like making gadgets. <gasps> That's something I'm not good at at all. Do you know a lot about redstone and and stuff like that? Because that is like a weakness of mine. Where is my spruce? Here it is. Um, I do not need any more seeds, but there you go, I guess. Then we have this one with that and that and random egg uh, we will leave that uh, we can put this in here and in and in and in and la, la, la. I guess the rest can come with me oh I still have a trap door on me so uh, not a trap door my goodness a tripwire um where am I putting a tripwire oh leather thank you um, a, a tripwire can exist. I don't know where. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> There's a tripwire. Cool. Glad we got that sorted. Thank you. All right. Nice. Let me through the door, please. Huh. <sighs> Better. You're holding one of the flies in your hand. Oh, it's lost a wing. Oh, that's really sad. That's really sad. It's walking. Oh, I hope that it has good heart and can survive. I bought a few redstone books when you played properly. Oh, so you know how to make things. Nothing crazy. 
Interesting. Yeah, redstone, like I said, is still something wildly weird to me. I, um... Not a strong suit of mine. Not even remotely. <laughs> Origins mod allows one to follow their origin. Race. Like a cleric, Merlin. Oh, to change their... Oh, sorry. <laughs> oh my goodness. How do I say that one? Susplakni? <laughs> Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the kinship. It is so lovely to have you here. I don't know how that's become my catchphrase, but it somehow has. <laughs> Welcome to the kinship. Okay, okay, okay. Stay. And that, that. Nice. And... I thought I had the bed. Never mind. Where's the bed? I have the bed. Everything is fine. Nothing to panic about. Interesting. So, origin mods allows one to change their origin race, like a cleric, merling, etc., an arachne, an endering, a dragonling. So, these are things within Minecraft. You're gonna feed it some sugar? Oh, that's really sweet. I hope that it enjoys the things that you feed it. Um, there's the link, by the way, guys. That is the link to the character. Uh, not to the character. To the game that I voiced a character in. <laughs> um, like I said, I'm not sure if it's currently working. Only because the dev of this indie game is hosting the server himself. And, uh, and uh, therefore, I don't know if it's currently on. But that is the link. It, it is. It's, it's, it is the link. Used to watch a guy whose redstone builds were insane. I can imagine the things you can do with redstone is pretty full on. And I'm going to have to figure it out. It's probably something, honestly, that I would do in creative mode. I would literally switch to creative mode just to, like, do redstone <laughs> builds with. Because, man, complicated, messy, tough, difficult. These are words for redstone. Appropriate words for redstone. <laughs> uh, cool. Yeah, that'll do. That can go there. It's probably not the best texturing. Hmm. Uh, actually, it's not that bad. It's not that bad. We might come to the section over here and add some things. Hi. You didn't escape, so you are not one of mine. Would you like to be? Would you like to live in a world with lots of piggies to choose from? <laughs> Would you like that? Hey, look at this over here. What is this wonderland of other piggies? You were looking in. You wanted it. Come, come, come. You fully crowd dived. I'm here for it. Okay, good job. Good piggies. Enjoy. <laughs> um, whilst I'm thinking about it, I know how to fix this a little bit, so... Let's take this one and do that. And then maybe we can take this one. Il Mango or Ray's works or Mumbo Jumbo. Oh, you're talking. Okay, okay. I was like, what are these words? <laughs> what is happening right now? But you're talking about the creator who did the redstone builds. Understood. <laughs> I was like reading. Il Mango, Ray's works or Mumbo Jumbo? Sounds like you are speaking Mumbo Jumbo to me right now. Understood. Mumbo was the creator with the redstone builds. Should have. I should have pieced that together. Snackery the rogue pig. <laughs> it was rogue. The fact that it was on the other side of the fence means that it was not one that I collected. And it was like standing at the fence looking in. So I'm like, hey buddy, you want to join everybody? You want to have some family time? Okay, okay, okay. So, what's next is the cows, basically. Okay, there's another pig. Um, That's fine. That's fine. We can get another pig. The, the more piggies, the better. <laughs> Why not? Okay. Hey, you up here. Hello, hello. Hi, I see you escaping. 
Would would you would you like to join a family? Hey, 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 you. Hey, come this way. <laughs> yes, you. Come this way. Come on. I'm going to need to get some cows now and we can fill them up. All right, come on. Look at all these people you can have a family with. Nice. Thank you. Thank you. Good job. Well done, piggies. Love it. Now let me out without escaping. Thank you. I think I've probably got stream elements. How? Why? You? Where did you come from? You know what? I. I'm. We can get some food. Three. Okay, that was generous. Uh, where do I have a campfire? I think I have one in the house. We can cook this up. Uh, I was trying to say I should probably cool down on stream elements a little bit. <laughs> they might be a little overzealous there. Okay, can I do it from here? Yes, I can. Nice. We'll cook those. Kindrate. <laughs> For hydrate? Kindrate. You're naming the fly Rox. Rox is eating honey. Oh, that's so good to hear. I'm glad Rox is doing well and eating the honey. That's super cute. Okay, you can cook now. Or is it because you're... Oh, there we go, there we go. Thank you very much. Very kind of you. All right, all right, all right. All right, all right, all right. Do I still have... Yes, I do. So I guess I can go looking... In the surrounding areas first. Because I know that there are some cows in this area that could have a family with us in a little pen. Just where are they is the question. This can come down to you. Thank you. I believe there was one this way before. <laughs> Whether it stayed this way is another question. Hello? Nope. That's a chicken. Hello? Hello, moo cow. That's a sheep. That's a chicken. Oh. Oh, I thought that was like going to go down underneath like a secret spot. A bunny, some sheep. There's another chicken. Where are the cows? There were there were cows here. There's a cow. One. We got one cow, and it's got a. We got two cows. Hello. This is all we need. So many bunnies. Oh my gosh. Is that a? Does that bunny have? Oh, it's got white feet. This bunny has white. Feet. I just spat everywhere. <laughs> oh, I was so excited about the bunny. I just spat everywhere. <laughs> oh, that's not embarrassing at all. <laughs> Did I just lose the counts? Hey, you guys. I'm cool, I promise. <laughs> Come on. Oh, my gosh. Campfires are so cool. I agree. Very useful. Come on. Hello? Come on. You, both of you. Come on. Come, come, come. We're nearly there. Come on. Hi. Mmm. Love the smell of wheat. Come, come. Let's go. This way. Stop doing it. Why are you not so attentive as the other ones? Hello? Come, come. 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 Yeah. Come on. Stop. Stop. This way. Nope, uh, nope, nope, this way. This way. Come on. Come, 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 come. Come, 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 come. In we go. In we go. Squeeze those. Good job. Nice work. Thank you so much. Okay, so good. Love it. Fantastic. Nice. <sighs> You like soul soul campfires? We do need a plains village. It would be very useful. I don't think there are. I. What have I explored? I have explored in this way direction a little bit, and in that way direction a tiny bit, and in this way direction a tiny bit more. <laughs> I don't think I've gone that way. Hmm. 
we probably do need some exploration pretty soon. You're not wrong. You're not wrong. Okay, so let's think. Um, where do I have? <laughs> where do I have my stuff for the lush foresty stuff? Where are they? In here somewhere. Here? Nope. Here? Nope. Here? Nope. Here? Nope. 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 But I will take that and that, and you can have that. Uh, nope. 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 There we go. I knew it was one of these somewhere. Cool. That's a start. That's a nice start. I think that cows is more interesting than chicken. I think it was. <laughs> I think you're right. Okie dokie. Okie dokie. Oh, it was the bee. I was like, something's moving over there. It was a bee. I'm going away from the bed. Hold on. We'll, 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 we will get some sleep before running back over that direction. Uh, though I'm a little bit early. So, how are you guys? How's everything going? Finding a village would be very useful. You're absolutely right. A plains village, particularly, would be fantastic. I don't know if... I don't know if um, I'm going to find one anytime soon. But perhaps, perhaps we could have a little look-see. It might not be the worst idea. Okay, is it sleep time yet? Yes. Yes. <sighs> I wish that riding horses was a little bit more efficient. Because they're definitely faster. But... They do have a little issue <laughs> of getting stuck in trees. <laughs> it's not very helpful. So, whilst we're here, whilst we have a pen with some cows in it, this stream is so relaxing to watch. Oh, I really appreciate that, Ash Shallow. Thank you so much. It's about to be a little less relaxing because I'm, I'm Mike. I'm. The moment I pulled out the sword, they all turned. They all turned and looked at me. <laughs> I might, um, I might have to. I'm so sorry. I'm really, really sorry. I'm really sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm really sorry. I could relocate some of you. I guess it's too late. Riding horses is going to be buffed? Ooh, do tell me more. In what way is it going to be buffed? Will they be able to go through? leaves and trees because <laughs> that'd be mega helpful i'm so sorry ash i'm so sorry i have a home for cows to be now and we will grow them up but i needed leather i needed leather pretty badly and i'd rather kill the cows and the horses so um i'm so sorry i'm really sorry that had to happen <laughs> i'm Seppo. i'm sorry no one look right no one saw it right it didn't nothing happened everything's fine <laughs> i'm sorry i'm so sorry oh no stop stop now you're hurting my heart a little you're not spoiling it that's not spoilers i'm not watson tell me tell me what the change is <laughs> oh my goodness we can put those in there. At least they will fill our bellies. They will be useful. Um, <coughs> I actually don't have that many pages. I might need to go get some pages. Yep, I don't know why. Okay, 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 okay. At least I can make one more here. When I have the right resources in my hands. Um, yep. And... Sure. Uh, it's slabs, isn't it? I bet it's slabs. I always forget. Nope. It's this. That's good. So, oops. So, I've done this a little the wrong way. I think I need like one more here. One more here and stop. One more above. So we can do that. Yeah. What's the start? This is not where it's staying anyway. The way they all looked over you, like, please don't do this. 
I know. That's what I'm saying, Seppo. I pulled out the sword. And they were like... But you all looked at me the moment I touched the sword. It's like they knew. My heart, man. My heart, man. Oh, man. It's, it is pretty. It is pretty heartbreaking. We will grab a bit more um, paper by this way direction. There, that way. Well, we will grab the cane to create the paper in this way direction. Bam! 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 It's very satisfying doing things like sugarcane, Sh sugarcane, netherrack, um, like 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 sand when you got a really efficient shovel, just that full. Vroom, it's so satisfying. Okay, I'll tell you now. <laughs> Thank you for keeping me on the edge of my seat. Uh, breeding two good horses. You'll now get a better horse. It'll jump faster, higher. It'll jump faster. It'll 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 jump higher. It'll run faster. <laughs> and oh, that's weird. Um, and it'll have better health. Well, heck yes. So better breeding. Okay, that's... Oh, okay. Uh, that's good. Don't, hold on. I don't suppose putting these together, like... Doesn't work like that. They weren't, they weren't like, combine efficiencies and be... <laughs> it doesn't work like that, does it? Oh, it does! <laughs> okay! <laughs> oh, that's funny. I should have known that, but I didn't. Why not? I feel like I've just wasted diamonds, but why not? <laughs> there you go. I learned something today. <laughs> Still learning how to do Minecraft. Do you ever stop learning? Really? This game has so many interesting features. Okay, there's some more books. Oh my gosh. I didn't know. I didn't. I don't know much about enchanting at all. And I will be honest. It's because whenever I played Minecraft with people... I would build things in exchange for them enchanting things. So now that I'm on my own, I'm like, I need to learn how to do this on my own. And I have been focused on building too much to like do it properly. Um, that's like the maximum of what I need, right? Like, technically this should be here. And then, do I have anything in there? Um, snowballs? <laughs> when did I get snowballs? Uh, 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 e, e. Is that how this works? I don't think it is. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know how this works. You guys are probably screaming at me like, what the hell are you doing, woman? Um, <clears throat> I don't think this works like this either, but let's just say I put this in. So that means I have like max levels? I don't know. Question, why would I spend seven levels on the same thing you can give me for one? Why? Do, how does that work? I don't know. I think I just ruined. I just ruined it, didn't I? I don't know how it works. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> sure, that can go in there. Why not? You can go in there too. Why not? Where did I get those from? From the cows. I remember now when I slaughtered them. Sorry. Um, this one. And where's the gunpowder? I have gunpowder up here. Yes. Uh, let's close that door. Uh, little, little, um. The bones are in this one, I think. I need a better inventory system. I know I need a better inventory system. Um, actually, I will hang on to that. Never mind. Okay, okay. I have more leather. When? Oh, from just this in general. Never mind. And... Where's the sun? Okay. So 
So basically, you build things for me. I make sure you survive. <laughs> yeah. Yup. I built it wrong. I probably did. I probably did. Would you like to correct me on how I build it? <laughs> Please, by all means. You're welcome to correct me on how I build it. Um, I'm going to run this way real quick because I do not think... I do not think there's anything out this way. I think it becomes ocean pretty quick. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Uh, mm, I could be wrong, actually. I could be wrong. Is it actually land? I thought it became sea. Oh, that's dense. That's really dense trees. Move out of my way. Take the table outside. I should probably just take it outside. You're right. But I will need to build all the bookshelves again. You know? Oh, hold on. This connects to a snowy biome. I do remember that now. Oh, is that a peony? Hello, peony. Hello? Let me in. It's a lilac. Nice. I will take it. Hi. Give me. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme give all the flowers. I am a flowers. Ooh, and this. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, 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 yes. Thank you, thank you. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> and this, and this, and this, and this. Yep, 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 yep. Don't. Yep, 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 yep. Give them all to me, please. Like, you can't lay. There we go. There we go. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, 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 okay. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. What is that? Oh, it's the back of a wolf. Hi. You just looked real weird from back there. I didn't notice you. I didn't notice you from your back door. Your iPad died? Oh, that's always frustrating. Welcome back, though. Um, I'm precariously adventuring probably where I shouldn't be in the night time. But I wanted to know what was in this way direction. So here I am. Ooh, interesting. Hello? Interesting. Um, I should probably head back to a bed. I say as I go in the wrong direction. <laughs> I guess I'm exploring more. Oh, hi, you're a sheep. You're a sheep. How about I make a bed? Sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Hi. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. How many do I have? That's two. One more sheep. Hello? Oh, hi. Hey, buddy. I'm so sorry. I'm really sorry. I'm so sorry. Okay, okay, okay. Um, bed, please. Oh, I, of course, picked the big tree. I'm not going to leave half a tree behind. That wasn't very smart. I already had them on me as well. I didn't need to even cut down a tree. You're kidding me. What am I doing with my life? Oops. Nope. That. Um, 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 um. This. This. Thank you. Fix. I feel like you've gotten in some kind of circle. A circle of what? Of topics? <laughs> or of walking? In different directions. Because this is a different direction to where I was. I, sh I should have made I should have made an axe. It Do doesn't matter. We're going in this way now. I just wanted to know what was this, what was this way? It's a bee. Hi, bee. Where'd you go? Bee? Bee? Where are you? Oh, 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 <laughs> my stomach just dropped. Okay, there you are. Hey, B. Ah, move. <gasps> so cute. I love him so much. All right, all right, all right. Exploring this direction. Around the map, it's not a circle. I, I, I will say that much. Um, this is in a new direction. I haven't actually been in yet. There are so many trees. Oh my gosh, there's so many trees. Leave a block gap between the table and the shelves. Oh, yes. You're right. I do remember that. 
I love bees. It's a magician. Disappear and reappear. It is. It was like a magician. Okay, I'm going to need to get down. There's so many bees. I need silk touch, man. I need silk touch so I can get their beehives, man. I know you can make like the fake ones, but I want the authentic beehives. So I need silk touch. Okay. We won't go too much further, I promise. I just wanted to know what was in this direction. And it turns out, so much. <laughs> so, um, <laughs> we'll go a tiny little bit further to see if there's any kind of clarity other than trees. And we will, we will, we will figure it out. Can you catch bees to make honey? You sure can. You sure can. So you can make fake beehives or with a special enchantment on your pickaxe, you can collect the original beehive. Each beehive has up to three bees and you can collect their honey. You have to be careful though. You have to collect it by putting a campfire underneath them so that the smoke calms them down just like real life bees. That's how you truly actually relocate beehives. You you smoke them out. You put them to sleep. Um, yeah, you can collect honey. Where are we now? Oh, okay. Oh, what a strange... I know I have my water clear on. What a strange mix of things there. Okay. <laughs> Tree parkour! And a campfire to collect the hive. Yes, you do need oop, that too. Okay. Promise, not much further. We've just hit planes now. So I'm just going to check if over this section there might possibly maybe maybe be like a plains village or something. Unlikely, but I'm going to look and then run back home. <laughs> maybe I should have brought the horse. Okay. Everybody, fingers and toes crossed. We are looking for a plains village. Hold on. What's that rendering in? Is that a plains village? I can't. What is that? That might just be a tree. Hold on. What? What is that structure? What is that structure? Oh my gosh. Let me swim faster. Thank you. That looks cool. I have been in the nether. Um, it was just a tree, wasn't it? Oh, it's a ruined portal. Oh, right. I thought it was going to be like a village rendering in. <laughs> okay. <gasps> oh, far out, man. What did I do that for? <laughs> Should not have jumped. Okay. Ruined portal. Cool. Um, what have you got? You have silk touch. Does that work on beehives? Sure, I'll take the rest of it. What are you? Feather falling. I really gotta start enchanting things. Hey, Mr. Ho, do you work on bees? Do you work on beehives? I'm not gonna fall down that again. Time to pray. Thank you. You kind of remind me of Mumsa for some reason. I'm not sure if I know who that is, actually. Ooh, I'll take some pumpkins. I don't really need pumpkins, actually. I don't need them. I don't need them. I don't need them. I think we are very unsuccessful in a plains. In a plains village, please. Please. We need to pray for a plain village. <laughs> but I can maybe try... The other thing. Man. Does this work? I know I can't do it. I mean, I know it's advised not to do it unless you have the campfire and the, and the, and the other things, but it doesn't work. It's got so touchy, you know? It doesn't work. Probably not. Can you, um... Hmm. Hold on. I 
I don't think there's a Plains Village anywhere nearby. That's pretty disappointing. You saw some pretty flowers? This way? Some pretty horses, too. Hey, pretty horses. How you doing? Hey, buddies. Look at all of you. Oh, my gosh. So cute. This is big. Let me look. Man, the clay, the claves, the claves and clafts, the claves, the caves and cliffs update. It's pretty mega. Jeez, man. Okay, pretty flowers. Hey, hey, pretty flowers. I'll take you. Thank you, thank you. I think I don't have the red ones. Give me some of those. Thank you. Okay, yeah, I said, I said, I think I said claves and claps, and I didn't mean to. I, I <laughs> that happened. <laughs> There's more horsies. Okay, I've explored way more than I intended to. I honestly did not realize all of this was back here. So uh, I guess it's time to return and hope I don't get lost. Um, <laughs> this could be interesting. Could be interesting. I say as I keep going in the opposite direction. A village, please? Please? Hello? Hello, village? Oh, a white horse. Hi. I have nothing and I want you, but I have nothing to take you home with me. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Oh, host, do you work on beehives? And you can use the fire charge to make a coloured firework figure. Ooh. Oh, that's going to be a big cliff. I was like, what is that rendering in? Jeez, man. I cannot explore anymore. <laughs> let's, let's return. I have a beehive that I definitely want to relocate. So let's focus on that. Um... After I get more flowers. <laughs> Don't mind me. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. We will head back. You can still take... I could. I could. You're right. I could tame the white horse. And then it will be mine when I come back for it. It's a very good point. Where are you? Where have you gone? Hey, cutie patootie. Would you like to... Uh... Will you let me... Hi. Get down. Be my friend. Stop it. Be my friend. Be my friend. Be my friend. Stop it. You're being very temperamental. Come on. Yes. Hey, Sunshine. I wish I could ride you. But we have a tamed. We have a tamed. So that's something. Let's um let's have a nap together. That sounds really cute. Stay right there. I'm glad I saw the sun go down because I would have been walking in the wrong direction back home again. <laughs> um where the heck did the horse go? It's over there. Okay, cool. Man, will you just let me sleep? There we go. Okay, okay, okay. Well, I am stoked to see that there is a horse that exists. This is the way home. Okay, 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 okay. Well, that was a big detour. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed Adventure Time. <laughs> Adventure Time was, uh, I don't know if it was worth it. <laughs> I just wanted to know what was out this way. But we discovered the answer. So. And that's how you make friends. <laughs> you write them in a <laughs> yeah, I, That's not how you make friends, guys. Don't always ask people before you jump on their backs. 
Oh my gosh. There is at least a lot of really cute things out here. Like there's a lot of cute horses that could be fun. And such an expansive place to build in. Um, not that I really need planes anymore. I'm, I'm kind of doing my planes build. <laughs> but, you know, that's something. Um, so, this way direction, I think, is home. I hope it is. Let's not fall in that lava pit. Did you see that? Did, did you see that? Lucky I did not see it. Lucky I saw that, I mean. Lucky I didn't see it. Oh my gosh. Can you imagine? Lucky I didn't see it and I died here and lost all my items. <laughs> no, uh, it's good. It's good. It's very good. I am very glad that I did not fall into that. Okay, okay, okay. You know what? Maybe it was worth it because I'm holding a Silk Touch hoe. And I needed Silk Touch something to relocate my cute little beehive that I have. So, I mean, I guess something of it was worth it. Uh, do I need to be up there or is down here okay? I do not remember. Which side was home? Was it that side or was it this side? We will find out. <laughs> we will find out. I'm a little nervous, actually. Because imagine if I just went the complete wrong way. Hmm... Bloody holes scare the crap out of me. You just come out of nowhere and... I'm glad I don't play hardcore. Because imagine... Just imagine like not paying attention to where you're going. At least that one has water at the bottom. But imagine not paying attention to where you're going. And you just fall down a hole into lava like we saw before. This is not the way home. Actually, this is the way home. It's just slightly to the wrong side. This is the way home. We're fine. We are fine. I recognize this place, I think. I think I recognize this place. <laughs> Ice skating! Woo! Look how fast we're going. That's what we need. Keep your peepers out for jungle wood. I have not found a jungle biome yet. You're right. I need to keep my peepers out. Um. So this is where we should come out under an island. That has a bunch of horses on it. I believe I know where I am. I believe. I think. We're going to find out. Hmm. Maybe I take it back. Oh, look at that. Uh, maybe I don't know where I am. Hold on. Hold on. We might be doing accidental. <laughs> we might be doing some accidental um exploration, but I I think we're okay still. Yeah, look, we're fine. We're fine. I knew exactly where we were. See, that's my little bridge. That line over there. That's <laughs> you see, <laughs> we're fine. Everything's fine. This is the island to our right that has the horses on it, so everything is fine. Oh man, but I was all stressed for a second there. See. There's this little island that's got horses on it. It's really cute. There's 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 my sugar cane. Oh, there's a little hole down here. Where does that go? I absolutely know where. Swim faster, please. And below us is the mine shaft I got name tags out of. So that's good. That's good. Okay, we are home. It's good to know that travel in Minecraft is endless. One day, we will be picking up our stuff and we will be moving out of a medieval city and into a brand new location to build a brand new thing in. God, man, that's going to be really... Is what that's going to be. Okay. Let's um take my excitement for having a silk touch hoe over to the beehive.
I really hope this works. I hope you're not trolling me. I don't think you are, but I really hope that uh, this works. And then we can move the um, the beehive to where I would rather them be. You're trying to draw me? Are you really? Oh, that's so cute. I need to read that again because now I doubt that that's what you said. I'm trying to draw you right now. Oh, you are. <laughs> that's really sweet. Do you like to draw very often? Drawing is something I cannot do. I feel like I have a lot of uh, ability in many different creative spaces. Drawing is not one of them. You do not want to see my drawing. It's not good. It's not at all good. You love drawing? I, I wish I was good at it. I most certainly am not. Okay. Um, are the bees in it though? Oh, I'm really risking things if the bees aren't in the beehive. I, just, I don't know if the bees are in the beehive, so now I'm risking a lot. Oh, I just got very sleepy. Let's... What am I looking for? I'm looking for more of these. Done. You're terrible about drawing, but you're good. But you have... But. You're terrible at drawing, but you have a good colour palette. What do you mean by that if you don't mind me asking like one of the palettes that you mix paints on like you've got a really cool one of those or you're really good at like picking colors that go well together thank you mm, whilst i'm here might as well where is it this one this one might as well throw some of those in this this and this and then these lovely jubblies Oh, also this. Cool. Nice. I wish I could draw, man. All right. I really hope that the bees are in it. Picking colors. <laughs> I think that's awesome. Being able to, like, assign really good... Um, colors together can really make or break different things for sure what color are my eyes you can't really see i don't know if that helped <laughs> i don't know if that helped <laughs> they're blue i have blue eyes they're very blue i can like no i'm not gonna do that <laughs> i can no no i'm still not gonna do that <laughs> they are very blue <laughs> I can't believe I just did like three turns of me going, mm, no, I'm not going to do that. Mm, no, I'm not going to do that. I'm crazy. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Have a good bees. Have a good be have. Okay, okay. 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 They're there. I... I'm not sure that works. <laughs> I don't know why I did that. Um, now I want an axe. Please give me an axe. I mean, please give me some iron. I can't remember if I have any here. Do I? I do not. I do not. Look, a wooden axe will do just fine. Da -da -dum. Here. And here. There we go. <gasps> yes, sir. Yes. Okay. Great. There was a bee in the hive. Everything is fine. Who went? You didn't think it would. <laughs> oh no. Can you imagine if it didn't work and I took you at your advice and it didn't work? Can you imagine? I would have been very upset. <laughs> 
This is a tree that I was building when I was just trying to collect wood, basically. And uh, so I planted this tree, it grew up and it had a beehive. And ever since, I just can't bring myself to bring it down because I haven't had silk touch to be able to do that. Now, however, now we got a silk touch hoe that actually works. So, heck yes. I'm glad you were right, Aragorn. <laughs> I would have been so sad. Oh, man. Thank goodness that worked. There we go. We'll put that there. I'll have to now get um, glass bottles to collect honey with. Man, I'm going to have to get glass bottles. Where do I have glass bottles? I don't know. I can get glass. Do I have sand in here anywhere? No sand? I don't think I have sand anywhere in here. Ah, oh, man. Uh-oh. Um, let's do that. <laughs> and, and, and now I'm panicking. I want sand. I don't think I have a... Well, I can make a shovel now. Let's do that. Perfect. Um, might as well put them back. <laughs> might as well <laughs> do all that. Um, 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 um. Oh, look. I probably had a shovel. No, I didn't. Everything's fine. I forgot to find those. Anyway, 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 I'm getting sidetracked. I want, I want, I want, I want, I want, I want the things. I can put that there. You should not be there. When did I make you? Did I make you or did I find you? I do not remember. Um. Hold on. Before I go diving into the water. Let's not go over the pumpkins. I will fall on them. <laughs> you had a D&D &D dream last night? Ooh, what happened in your D&D &D dream? I would love to hear. Oh, I also heard that the Minecraft 120, they're going to have actual cherry blossom trees. Is that for real? Because that's really cool. I like that. Sure, you guys can go in here. Let's just... Let's just... Ugh, I've made so many bookshelves. I did not need to. Um, 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 um. You coursed it? Yes. Okay, 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 okay. Sure. This will do. This will do. Let's go get some sand. Oh, one last thing before I go. Just real quick, do I have any up here? Because I know I made some glass to make the top bit here. Let's just see if I have any sand or glass hanging around. I have one! <gasps> Yay! <laughs> Alright then. Do I have any like in here? Ooh, but I have that. No, I don't. No, okay. Cherry blossoms, yes! Okay, that's really cool. I'm glad that they added cherry blossoms. It's really interesting to see how people have made their own cherry blossoms. They've done some beautiful custom trees. But having cherry blossoms is going to be real cool. And armor trims? Ooh. Sounds interesting. Let's fall down here. Tell me about your D&D &D stream. I'd love to hear it. I nearly said stream, but you said dream. So please... Do tell me about the D&D uh, &D dream. Alright, let's take some from here. I'll have to reconfigure the landscape later. Make it look natural again. Boop. 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 Hey, Ash, do, um, do you build... Do you build... Sorry, do you draw... With like, uh, do you draw digitally or are you drawing by hand? Either way, I find it fascinating because I cannot do it. It's something I wish I could do, but I definitely cannot. The best I can do, the best I can do is the fox that is in your subscription badges and the emoji where it's raining foxes. I drew those. And that's the best I can do, a little fox. <laughs> um, but yeah. 
drawing digitally seems like it should be easier, but it's most definitely not. Especially like the whole going from like you, like maybe you have a tablet and you got to draw with the pen things. Very different experience. Oops, I didn't mean to put you. You can go back. You're drawing digitally right now, but you do both. That's awesome. How long have you been drawing for? Oh, I was like the water looks weird. It's uh, it's clay. It's actually more of an isekai, isekai, isekai dream. Oh, uh, the anime genre you were telling me about, but it was heavily D and D based. Oh, so that's the anime genre where it's like they find themselves in a alternate universe or a different universe. It doesn't necessarily have to be alternate. You have a cheap iPad, no pen. <laughs> You've been drawing for some months. Ooh, that's awesome. I find, um, I've heard drawing is really good for your mental mental health and mental capacity and mental spaces. Okay, so I have a lot of sand. Probably got more than I needed, but that's okay. <laughs> it's totally okay. We will go and cook the sand to make some glass. To be able to make glass bottles to then finally collect some honey. How's that sound, honey? <sighs> this is going to be a nice view, man. So cute. There's more pigs. Are they escaping from somewhere? Wait, they might be escaping from somewhere. Let me just check. Unless it's just like this is where pigs spawn and there's just so many of them. But maybe... Are they like, getting up on... Nope. What about this one? Are they getting up? Nope. So you guys are completely independent. You are not one of my pigs. There's three of you. They can't escape, right? No, they can't go that way. And they can't go this way. Even though they're trying. Wow, okay, so nope, they're just pigs that have spawned in this location. Have you always been there? <laughs> I must have been. Well, you know what, if you don't mind. I'm sorry. But food is good. Sorry! Where's the other one? The other one lives. The other one lives because I do not see it. Okay, okay, it lives. Okay, it lives. It's fine. It can survive. I'll grant it life. <laughs> oh! I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry! Okay, okay, okay. But food is really good. Food is needed. Ugh. You can tell you're tired when you look at the bright lights you have on stream and your eyes water a little bit. <laughs> Oh my gosh. The bees might be the last task we do for this stream. Whew. Made my nose water even. What the heck? Okay. That is enough to make some glass bottles. Let's make a bunch. Let's make nine. <laughs> I'm done with the drawing, but you don't know what to do with it. Oh, thanks, Blue Milk. You are more than welcome to come join us in the Discord and put the drawing in there, Jello. Ash Jello. Ash? Ash? Would you like to be called Ash or Jello? You just found Minecraft on Switch? Another reason for you to get one. Oh my gosh. I would love a Switch. It's, uh, it's, uh, not something I can afford right now, but I would love one. So, you're not wrong. You are not wrong, but I have just paid for rent bond for a new car. <laughs> a switch might be a little while. It might be a little while. Why am I going this way? I remember. I remember. We want to collect the honey. So we can put this little bit of honey. And then, without them getting angry. Okay, good. Cool. One. <laughs> it's a start. It's a start. And then when you have enough, you can make 
uh, honey blocks. It's really cool. Okay. We will let them wake up now and they can do their thing. But that is how you collect honey in Minecraft. Oh, hold on. I'm taking the flint and steel with me and I should not be doing that. That should stay over there so that I can continue to do this properly. Nice. When did you used to get there? I will take you. <laughs> uh, I was in a forest with an elven archer and a half-breed ogre rogue, as well as a cleric. And the ogre said, "So where next to my shin? Apparently, my dream. Apparently, my dream made my shin. Oh, sorry. Apparently, my dream made me my name Shin, and then I said raid in a confused tone. Shin." I'm so sorry. I might be missing something just a little bit. Let me try one more time. Hold on. I was in a forest with an elven archer, a half-breed ogre rogue, as well as a cleric. And the ogre said, somewhere to next Shin. Apparently my dream made my name Shin. And then I said rage in a confused tone. Shin, Shin raid? Shinrad? Sinbad. <laughs> you have returned. Hello, Brad. Welcome back. Grub was grubbing. The food was good. I'm glad. I'm glad to hear it. Um, I want to cook this food. I want to cook this food. Isn't it really like... Aren't you like getting really close to... What did you say? It was 2 a.m. So what, it's 4.30 a.m. for you right now? Is that what it is right now? I don't need this much. You know what? This time, I will. you guys can go there. That's a silly thing. I'll never know that they're there. <laughs> we'll put them in a proper place. <laughs> Why does that make sense? We'll leave them in a place of nowhere. It's almost 5 a.m. Didn't you say you had to work at 9 and you're just eating bread? Sometimes you make no sense to me. Do you not need to rest so you can go to work at 9am? Is that what, is that not what you need to do? Uh, you, yes. Do I have plenty of cobble? Damn. Damn. That's a lot of cobble. Um... Where can I put the sand? Perfect. You work in four hours, but you can't sleep. Lay your head down. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. And rest your... I'm not going to sing to you. <laughs> can you imagine if I just like burst out in song? Is it night time? Oh, it's raining. I was like, didn't we just have night time? Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay, okay. So, next steps, basically, could be to take those trees down. That would help. But, let me take a look-see at where we're at. Should have brought some wheat with me. Should have brought some wheat with me because I bet you're able to grow. And by grow, I mean have more children. Damn it. Did I leave any behind? Was I smart enough to do that? Damn it! Let's go get some wheat. I only need two. You join my Discord? Oh, thank you, thank you. If my buddy was working right, yes! <laughs> Sweet lullabies. La 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 la. Just for you. So we went to a raid den. Uh, so we went to a raid den. The elf name was Kohaku. The ogre name was Malachite. And the cleric was Gothi. We were decently equipped and we entered the raid den. Thank you so much, Ash, for joining the Discord. That's really cute. Did you post um did you post the, the drawing you just did? Because I am very excited to see it then. How very exciting! I don't know if anyone's ever drawn me before. Uh, where am I going? Here. That's where we're going. Because why don't I just take a few? Why don't I just take a few so I can leave them over there? 
I should have done this before, you know, when I was saying like Wham, plant, wham, plant. I should have just done what I just did then. Anyway. Anyway. Okay, 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 okay. I don't need the seeds. We'll take them back. We'll put them back. We'll put them away. We're not putting them back anywhere. I am so fucking tired, but also so wide awake. I feel that. That was me the other night. That was m that might have actually been me after D and D when we couldn't actually D and D. Um, I was wired, man because I wanted to play and we didn't get the opportunity and that's no one's fault but I just mean like we went in intending a session and it didn't it just didn't happen so like all these things that have been on my brain they didn't have anywhere to go I was like god damn god damn only two of you can have children so like there you go mm. wait you got the picture you don't want to put it in the wrong chat Aww. that's totally fine there is a channel called Foxogenic uh, and Foxogenic is quite literally covering all of our photography needs. <laughs> like essentially selfies, pets, food, and drawings. It is covering all our photography needs. Oh man. I just like my sleeve against the desk <laughs> sounded really strange to me. And it scared me. Okay. So we have different bits and pieces. What I think I want to do is now throw to this side. Um, which means I might... What is that? Oh, it's a donkey. It was your ears. Your ears from afar look like antlers. And I was like, what are you? Um, what I want to... <laughs> that sheep hanging on one. Hanging on one block. Hey, buddy. You, you think you're a goat or something? Hey, buddy. Um... Here. Let's just pull this back a little bit. Um, just a little bit. Isn't this fun? <laughs> Don't you love watching people like break dirt on street? <laughs> I'm just opening it up a little bit. Because I think that I want to like have a path down the center here. We might put a like a farmer's house. But I want to put another pen for the sheepies. And a chicken coop on this side. And I'm terrible at aiming. You put it there? Thanks for the answer? Oh, of course. Thank you so much for sharing your art with us. I'm very excited to see it. I'll check it out after stream for sure. I'm very excited to see. It's really sweet. Thank you also for drawing me. I mean, that's awesome. You didn't have to do that. Um, and you did, so you shared your art. Thank you. I love the fox's face. Is there a fox nearby? Is it me? Do you like my face? <laughs> oh, you're referring to the drawing. Okay, okay, okay. So, the sheepies will be in this way direction. How much do I want the sheepies to have a space? Me. Maybe they hug. They hug this space. I don't know. I don't want that. I don't want it. What I, I don't want it like that. What I might do? What I might do is... What I might do is... What I might do? What time is it? Okay. What I might do then is... I would like... Maybe we might do it this way. We'll have like um. Yes. Maybe I want it back this way a little bit more. Like hugging here. Okay. Cool. Let's just take this up so I don't get confused. So that's going to be a wall, basically. That's what I'm ah, looking at. That's going to be wall. And then we can um, start following it 
around with fencing and stuff. So it might look something like something like it's going to be real big. doesn't need to be that big. You know what? Just mind. This is going to be the back wall. This one here. This is going to be the back wall. Here. <laughs> if you will not make it so big. It doesn't need to be that big. <laughs> it only needs to be for some sheep. The fox is cute. <laughs> How do we feel about skin packs and textures? Like, um... Like shaders and stuff for making the experience different. I'm all for it. Let's go back this direction. This way, that way. Nope. Uh, this way, that way, that way, that way. This way, that way. This, this, this way. Mm, let's maybe even it. Even, e even it. Let's even it. Let's even it out just a little bit how big is this one two three four five six it would make sense for it to line up so one two three four five six take this one out ba bam take that out ba bam take this out ba bam and we need one more, like. Eee, boop. Okay, okay, okay. So that's a pen. And then I don't need that much for a chicken coop. So I might pull this back a little. It's night time, isn't it? Yeah. Let's rest. I could use magic and I had martial arts skill and weapon master feet. So I was shredding through most of the goblins and the lizardmen. Uh, Malachite was dealing with the crystal golems. Malachite seemed to have the berserker skill and mainly used a shield for combat. Needless to say, he was a total tank. Absolutely. Does this sound like an epic D&D based dream? Um, that would be enough. Do I have any resources <laughs> just to make another shovel? Wood would be fine. You're good at drawing people, but also not. I can draw people, but not drawing based on people. Oh, interesting. I feel like a lot of people say it's the other way around. Um, like they feel like they're really good at drawing from a reference, but drawing from no reference um, is harder, apparently. So I think that's really cool that you're like the opposite of that. Okay, 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 okay. So let's slot in. Oh, hold on. We'll, we'll, we'll pull it back just a little bit more. Man, is there really stone under here? Oh, and am I aesthetic? <laughs> that is a well-deserved smile. A well-deserved smile. Kahaku dealt the dragon newts and gargoyles while Gothi seemed to be supporting us. Gothi was supporting us with what looked like an enchanting skill. Ooh. What did what what did that make you then? As far as a class goes. Okay, let's take you out. You're ruining my aesthetic. Boop 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 boop. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Um, that means we can have a chicken coop hugging. To make the chicken coop, I think I want to do like... I'm counting in my head. Um, I don't know, like one, two, three? And then it would have... No, 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 no. Maybe more like the three was in the center and then it has that. Maybe. One, two, three. One, 
So then it's all gosh, I'm sorry. Okay, so it's not gonna fit here. Um, I could fit it that way. I need to think about this. You love drawing weird people, mostly with oh, like fantasy style people. Green, purple skin, blue hair. Awesome. That's really cool. But look at it, I think I was a paladin or a sort of knight that could use magic. Oh hell yeah, like an eldritch knight fighter or something. Um I'm actually wondering. The chicken coop might make more sense if I fill this space in. Might as well. You could do it on this side. Do I have more? I do not have more. That's okay. I have plenty more in chests over this way. And you know what? I don't need these. So how about you just... You take them. <laughs> Eat them or something. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, 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 okay. We'll come over in this direction and we'll just fill this little bit in and then I think that'll be the perfect place for a chicken coop. Is this not big enough? Yeah, it's plenty big. It is plenty big. It is way bigger than it probably needs to be. The earth golem boss appeared. Oh, golems are tough. They're difficult ones to, to beat. Like a mage finding golem is pretty scary and like... Really, really any golem. Really any golem. Guardians of whatever are tough ones to beat. Oh, chicken. Would you move, please? Out. Thank you. You'll need to move again, though. Or you'll become food. Thank you. Good moving. Alright, let's uh, how do I terraform this in a nice way? Now that I have my expansive spot. Um, sure, let's copy what's right next to you. <laughs> in theory. That'll do for now. Okay, that's plenty of space to put in my chicken coop thoughts. To put in my chicken coop thoughts. Yep, that's how that works. Um, oh my gosh. Hello. There is many of you. And then that's what I put in the shippies. And then we really got some like farming sections happening. Up we go. I will take that. Thank you. And I will put that in there. I definitely don't have anything hiding. Good checking. Good chicken or good chicken? Nope, we're cooking pork. That was a terrible pun. <laughs> that was a terrible pun. I hope nobody heard it. I hope nobody heard it. Okay, okay, okay. So. Let's. Let's, 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 let's. Pop up this one. Put that one out. I'm going to have a real quick, sneaky little look-see at your sweet, sweet drawing. And then I think we'll have to call it tonight. Because it's, um, it is a little bit time for sleep. <laughs> it is time for sleep. I have to work tomorrow. Let's have a look-see. Oh, that is so cute. I love it. I see what you mean by the fox face, too. I was like, the fox face? It's so sweet. I love it. Thank you. It's so cute. I love the, like, the look on my face. I don't look particularly amused. I'm like, mm. <laughs> I love it, Ash. It's so sweet. Thank you for doing that. That's really, really sweet. I'm going to give you a little, little heart. There you go. And a little hype. There you go. Thank you. So Malachite told me that I should attack and I and he will support me. So I pulled out this. Meteor Blitz. 
that's like when the meteors keep coming down, right? That's pretty full on. Um, I will warn you, Aragon, that I'm going to wrap up the stream. So, um, if you... This was your reference photo! Oh my gosh! <laughs> oh my gosh! That's funny for people watching at home. It's basically me going... <laughs> That's adorable and hilarious. Um, Why well, you tell me the rest of your dream, Aragon? I'm going to quickly see if there's anybody that we can raid. Unless you guys have um, suggestions for raids, I'm also open to hearing suggestions for fellow friends that you might want to join forces with. Okay, so like none of my friends are streaming. Um. <laughs> the face I just pulled was not attractive. I will just have a little look, see in the Minecraft. I'll have a little look in the Minecraft. Uh, there's a there's a screen over here, by the way. That's why I'm moving over there. And I basically one shot it and passed out because all my men are up. <laughs> you one shot it and then you went book. Oh my goodness. That's a wild dream, though. I kind of want this dream where I'm, like, off on some crazy adventure. Um, let me check the Minecraft uh, category for any lovely people that we can maybe raid. This makes me so scared when we're raiding potential strangers, though. Because we have had some bad experiences with that in the past. But we can have a little look. Okay, it's really tough. <laughs> then woke up and said maybe I should make a story out of it. Oh, well, you could turn that into a little Minecraft, uh, not a Minecraft adventure, a um, D and D adventure. Like you should do a one shot or something. You got a hundred fox tails? Yes, so cute. Yes, they are definitely called fox tails. L is streaming. You are correct. Would you like me to? Would you like me to? Should we go say hi to L? That would be very sweet. We could pull up. We could pull up some love for L. What do you guys think? Should we go say hi to L? Let's lock it in. Let's lock it in. We'll go say hi. Um, for my lovely people who are going to join us, you can use that in our little raid when you go say hello. L is a lovely person, a friend of ours. Um, she's not streaming Minecraft though. I will warn you. <laughs> it is Ark, but she's adorable and she plays the game adorably. So I think it'd be a good time for those of you coming from, from, uh, from here, basically. Let's go say hi to Elle. Let's do it then. We'll go say hi to Elle. Oh, I'm so glad that you like her, Aragorn. She's such a sweetie, isn't she? Okay. Raid. It's happening. The raid is in place. Whilst I have you guys, I appreciate every single one of you for being here. It's been a really great time tonight. I love you guys so much. And uh, we have had some exciting news. Oh my gosh, guys. Check out the game, Noya. I voice act in a game. What the fuck? It's pretty cool. It's pretty damn cool. So uh, go check out the game, Noya. Um, it's early development stages and it's an alpha launch so i i'm that there's that <laughs> but it's so freaking cool seppo you are still here my lovely thank you so much for being here it has been such a pleasure having each and every one of you but it's been really cool to see you here too seppo thank you thank you every single one of you and i i am back tomorrow night and I uh, hope you hope, hope hope you have a wonderful day night wherever you are in the world. Have courage and be kind, and I love you all.